All right. You ready so, to get started now that we're 50 minutes sure. in? So I, I, I finally, I clicked uh, start recording on, on OBS. So, oh, so why don't you d briefly describe <laughs> what the, uh, what the book is and what it's about and all that. Um, all tomorrows is a book about the, uh, a proposed evolution of humanity over the next billion years, I believe it is. Right. Um, the full title is All Tomorrows, A Billion Year Chronicle of the Myriad Species and Varying Fortunes of Mam. Which is a amazing title for a book. Right? By Nemo Ramjet, who sounds like a fucking like, cyberpunk 2077 character. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Right. <laughs> could could I, he I, be I, a Kojima character, Ramjet? Yeah, Nemo Ramjet. Yeah, maybe. What was it? Uh, Dry Penisman. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nemo Ramjet. Um, well, I like it. His name is very fun. So the thing is, I'm going every time I go to another page, I'm going to have to swap over to a we can't look at it screen because sometimes on the next page there is pee pee or booba. <laughs> okay. um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to avoid the pee pee. So we're going to just be going between those. Yeah. Uh, and I'm sorry about that, everyone. But we have uh, man, and then as you can see, Martians come later and combine with man to make star men. That means somebody had have... sex, is what that means. Hey, uh oh, TOS, crazy. <laughs> um, let me let me just double check. Okay, here we go. To Mars, after millennia of Earthbound foreplay, <laughs> mankind's a <laughs> Mike. <laughs> Mankind's what? achievements on a <laughs> said foreplay is funny. Oh, hold on a second. I forgot something. Everyone who subbed and gifted subs, there's a very important thing we have to do. We have to welcome everyone to the bonus bean room. Oh, I can I can I can help with that now. Hold on. What Mike? I can't hear you over the bonus beans. Okay, thank you for affording that to me. Oh, and Prinny, uh, sh uh sh Shukuse, thank you very much for the sub. You get an individual bean. Yes, after millennia of earthbound foreplay, mankind's achievements on a noteworthy level began with its political unification and the gradual colonization of Mars. While the technology to colonize this world had existed for some time, political bickering, shifting agendas, and the sheer inertia of comfortable terrestrial usurping had made this step seem more distant than it actually was. Only when the risks clearly began to present themselves, only when Earth's environment began to buckle under the strain of 12 billion industrialized souls, did mankind finally take up the momentous task. All through the decades, traveling to and later settling on Mars have been envisioned as quick, relatively easy affairs, complicated but feasible and manageable in short term. As the push finally came to, came to a shove, it was realized that this was not the case. It had to go step by step. Atmospheric bombardment by genetically tailored microbes slowly generated a breathable atmosphere in a cycle that took centuries. Later, a few cometary fragments were knocked off course to bring forth seas, oceans, water. When the wait was finally over, remnants of Earth's flora and fauna were introduced as specially modified Martian remakes. When everything was ready, people came from their crowded world. They came in one-way ships, fusion rockets and atmospheric gliders packed to the brim with colonists sleeping in dreams of a new beginning. The first steps on Mars were taken not by astronauts, but by barefoot children on synthetic grass. They touched and grass. They took they took touched fucking them. forever, but they finally did it. Um, <clears throat> Maybe I, I should crop out <laughs> off the side panel? No, Lauren's in the way. I, I'm body blocking it. Somebody in chat said Mike robes. So like they're doing the Germa thing, but it's oh me instead God. of Germa, which is, which is this, that, that, that's awesome. <laughs> How, how much Germa have you seen? I haven't watched a lot of Germa. Uh, a, 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 a fair amount, a little bit. Okay. Uh, uh, enough, enough to, enough to say he he's definitely like earned his his place as like the king of Twitch or whatever. 
Understood. understood. As, as like the, you know, he's like the streamer streamer. I don't know how to explain that. Yeah, I, I understand. Like, I, I, he's really, um, I don't know, I think he's a genius. I kind of want to kind of want to suck his pee pee a little bit, but don't tell him understood. I said that. Understood. Yeah, and I'm over here just literally, I will have my mic muted for a whole minute with my beak flapping in the wind. <laughs> uh, oh, we got boobs. Yeah, we got, uh, Tib Tibby. A lander ferries the first people to the pre terraformed Eden of Mars. Beautiful piece of art. Gosh, look at the way, it, like, I, this artist really is excellent. Looks nice. Yeah, it looks nice. Um, but I was promised penis, and I'm still not seeing penis. Don't worry, we'll get there. Uh, the Martian Americans. For several hundred years, Mars remained as a backwater, prospering but still dim compared to the splendor of Earth, which was glowing brighter than ever before. Thanks to the relocation of environmentally demanding industries to Mars, Earth could usurp everything without having to damage its tired biosphere. This was the terrestrial heyday, the climax of economic, cultural, and social development on old Earth. This, however, was not to last. Like the gradual separation of America from her colonial mother, the governments of Mars adopted a new Martian identity. They became the Martian Americans. The difference between Earth and the Mars was not only political, a few generations in the lighter gravity came the new, gave the new Americans a spindly, lithe frame that would look surreal in their old home. This, combined with a certain amount of genetic engineering, took the Martian separation to a new level. For a while, the silent schism between the two planets was mutually accepted, and the balance of power hung in an edgy equilibrium. Edgy. Edgy, bro. <laughs> I can't believe they gave Mars a gun. <laughs> and made him say damn but the terra <laughs> but the terra martian standoff did not could not last forever with limitless resources and an energetic population mars was bound to take the lead can i just take a minute to like interject here and talk about how profoundly stupid this idea of martian americans is like why are they martian americans because they're because the concept of like they are separating from the earth as a colony like is that why they're called that or was this, these were people who came from the united states to, to go to mars no i like i i think the idea is it, they're making a comparison to america that, yeah yeah and like, that yeah yeah and it sucks that's dumb <laughs> that's dumb as fuck that's i i, I that's stupid I I think like it, it's it's a comparison to the early days of America, and I think it's fair. Yeah, and it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. Go ahead. It's not perfect, but it's fine. It's shit. I think I think it works. Okay. No, because it because it obfuscates it. Because the reason it sucks is because I just had to ask that question. Like, oh, like like what do you, what do you mean? Like, are they from the United States? And as as opposed to like what the European Martians? Like like why'd you do that? Like, might I, be like i don't understand it so it's bad no i i do no i un, no 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 i understand it and it's bad <laughs> it's no it's it's actually it's bad because i understand it <laughs> it it momentarily confused you and that scared you <laughs> no it con it confused me in in the sense of like i i i knew what he was doing but it gave me a put it distracted me from the fucking narrative. You understand? <laughs> like when you when you do something right, you're not temporarily distracted from the fucking narrative because you're like, wait, why is he calling it that? You know what I mean? <laughs> I think it, it it definitely is like Americentric being like, oh, a, any colony is because that's the only time in history that happened. Like, come on, it's right. fucking, it I, sucks. Maybe there's an argument for the scale of it. <laughs> Hey, Era 404, who has like gifted a lot to the channel, just in general, has gifted a sub to Germa985. Uh, congratulations, Germa. Uh, enjoy your froggy emo. I, you know, one day I hope that Germa opens up his Twitch chat, looks at all of his available emotes, scrolls down, and finds TL Froggy, and is like, "Wow, this streamer's a fucking jabroni." <laughs> I hope he sees the feet. I, I hope he, yeah. Why, why does the streamer have feet? 
And he looks like, oh, it's a furry. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> or a, I, well, it's a, it's a, it's an owl. So it's like a, it's, it's feathers. So what do you, what do you like? What do you call that? Beaky? Oh, fluffy. A beaky. Da downy. Oh. Downy. Like the guy who plays Iron Man? That, that, I, sure. Okay. <clears throat> an American. <laughs> uh, I'm saying a it's a Merocentric, but the, the Merocentric or whatever the fuck, but the author, it appears, is from Turkey, according to chat. Yeah, the, the, the English is not perfect, um, e even if it's pretty good. And then here we go. I, it's, chat Kirby is saying, Martin. I think Downey is a slur. What? For like somebody no, with I'm, Down syndrome. Oh, I think. no, I'm talking about like down feathers. All right, let's all cancel Fred, guys, because he God said he it. said he said um he said a slur. Sweat God frogs. We got any fucking sweat frogs in the chat? Did anyone actually think that's what I was using it as? Let's get some fucking sweat in the chat. Uh, it also it, it, uh, well well dude, it's 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 facetious. No, downy um, feathers. That's right, a, it's, Fred. It's I, facetious. Nobody nobody know, nobody cares. Okay, yeah, I know. Um, I know. But but it also, dude. Again, Robert Downey Jr. is walking around with a slur as his name chat. <laughs> like that's the guy's that's the guy's name. What do you want from him? Cancelled for existing. Like what like what do you want? Um what is Fred's accidental slur count now? Well, I mean, dude, I that that's just part of um if you're gonna stream on Twitch. You're gonna you're gonna use words and then chat's gonna tell you like <laughs> that's a slur, and you're gonna be like I had no fucking idea. And then and then the other half of chat will be like, um, it's not. And then you'll have to sit there and try to figure out, like, you, you just get to a point where it's like, I'm only going to speak in, like, fucking binary code from now on. Like, I'm seriously, <laughs> I'm just going to talk in, like, Morse code. Although you could say slurs in Morse code. I mean, you could. Yeah, I just, I'm just true. I'm just going to com com to communicate in a series of beeps. I'm going right. to communicate in a language that none of you understand, so you can't call me out for anything. One zero it's... zero one one zero. <laughs> Got him. Got him. Poggers. I know, I know one letter in binary, and that's it. Um, look at this guy's face. He's a Martian American. <laughs> look at the top of his head. Dude, that just looks like that just looks Hold like on. fucking like Tommy Pickles' dad or some shit. Hold on, hold on. I'm I'm looking this up now. It's like a Class B Cuspo character, right? Okay, hold on. I'm I'm scrolling back up for a second because. Bruh, look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> 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 ah, look at the top of his head. <laughs> look at his lips. <laughs> what is this video from? What is, what is the audio from? I don't even know. It's just but but holy I because I'm like I'm I'm sitting here like how what, was he looking at this book? <laughs> right. <laughs> Like was he was he actually looking at at all tomorrows at that point? No, I I think like this this was a clip where like he he was looking at someone in public. I I remember it being attached to a video where someone like put ketchup on someone's head. Yeah. He, uh. Anyway, he's he's a fucking like Nickelodeon character. He's like from a nickel. He just looks like an average. Like like when we were kids growing up watching Nickelodeon cartoons, Nickelodeon was like, yeah, this is what human adults look like. Enjoy. He's like Timmy yeah. Turner in real life. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, it's like a uh, Miguel Vasquez art. Remember Miguel Vasquez, the guy who takes all the cartoon characters and does them realistically. Yeah, yeah. There's a there's a fucking segue. Look at it, those things. Oh fuck, I'm not ready. No, you're not ready for that. Though you know. Oh, he does look like a big. Hour. He looks like a big mouth character. There it is. Oh, yeah, god, there it is. There it is. God, there it is. God, he god. does look like a fucking. Oh. oh my god, that ruined. ruined. Wild Thornberries was one of the cartoons I was thinking about. Yeah, yeah. 
Um, that look, I remember one thing from that show, and that's Nigel. Yeah, he's Nigel got like some some yeah. Nigel, some Nigel energy. Right. I rem- I were oh my god, I remember when he was a meme for a while. He kind of still is, not as much though. I remember there was a whole like. La- like overlapping Nigel Thornberry's voice with Lady Gaga. What the fuck? Why? Just just because sometimes Lady Gaga sounds like Nigel Thornberry when she's singing. <laughs> what the fuck, really? That was oh, that thing. sounds that sounds amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, hey, guess what, everyone? It's been an hour, and you all know what that means. It's time for everyone. To look after themselves, and that includes you, Mike. Everyone, stand up, stretch your legs, stretch your arms, get yourself a sippy. I'm not and I'll fucking see you doing back that. In about five minutes. I'm not doing that. I, Mike, I, I swear to God, I'm not gonna do that. Gonna I'm gonna do that. <laughs> no, I'll do. No, I'll do. So, so really, what? Like, you, you, you're making everybody take a five minute break? Yes. It's hydrate, stretch. So it's a good idea to get up at least once every hour if you have to sit for long periods. Yeah, but they'll they'll do it if they want to do it. No, they won't. The evidence of like heart issues and blood clots and legs actively argues against that that people will do it with me. <laughs> oh man, am I gonna die? Oh my god, you just activated my hypochondria on like a <laughs> you 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 just like hard fucking activated my hypochondria i'm sorry mike oh my god all right i'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna go i'm gonna go because now <laughs> now up. now i'm freaked out now you fuck stand me up, up and stretch dude there's a blood clot in my hey. fucking foot there's a blood clot in my god. foot i feel it i feel it right now you there's a blood clot you created one in my foot you, you did this to me we'll be right back everyone you did this to me
and stretching. But he'll we'll, we'll be we will be ready to host him again when he returns. While he's gone, I wanted to show all of you a couple of things. Also, uh, besides the new BRB art, I'm God damn it. That it sounds so doofy. The BRB art. He he <laughs> he's taking a dumpy. OK. No, I, I wanted to show all of you a couple of other things. Um, I'm I'm so glad that people like the BRB art so much. Uh, Tokyozilla did such a good job on it. I was, I was so excited. Like uh, they they were working on it gradually, and um, then when it was when it was finished, I just freaked out. <laughs> I've been so excited to show everyone, but I also um, I expanded my uh, my soundboard. So first of all, uh, we of course have the bonus bean room, but now we also have. Uh, then, of course, th this is one that people have been asking for. <laughs> I need to turn that up, actually. Let me crank that up. Because uh, I can turn up the volume. Here we go. Wait. There we go. That's better. <laughs> then, of course, we have... <laughs> just in case uh then i have another one that i'm very happy about <laughs> for when we see something cute uh, i do not have excuse me yet i didn't have um i didn't have time to put in everything that i wanted to uh, but then we also have wait let me turn it up this <laughs> the the solely from monsters inc grown i'm uh, back by the hello. way hello yeah hey hello can How i can i doing no moral theater uh I'm, I'm sorry what is that uh have you ever seen that clip no uh, from mystery science theater 3000 uh no i don't i don't i don't i don't think so it, it it's very short here. I'll I'll just show you real quick. Uh, here. We hope you've enjoyed no moral theater. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> no more. Oh, because the end you of the hope. movie was right. Right, it was fucking like just a pointless movie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There, there's yeah. no point at all to the movie. Just we hope you've enjoyed no moral theater. Um. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm ready to see some more freaks, uh, when you are. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh. we we've just barely scratched the surface. Don't worry, don't worry, everyone. I know it's taken us a while, but we've got another two hours, <laughs> and Fucking then we will do another dude. stream of this if we need to. Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. If you want, yeah. <laughs> well, um. let's continue. Civil War. The Martian turnover was expected to occur in two ways, either through long-term economical gains or by a much shorter but painful armed conflict. For almost 200 years, the former method seemed to take effect, but this gradual stretch eventually did break in a most destructive way. Almost since its establishment, Martian culture was suffused with an explicit theme of rebellion against Earth. Songs, motion pictures, and daily publications repeated these notions again and again until they became internalized. Earth was the old, ossified home that held humanity back, while Mars was new, dynamic, active, and inventive. Mars was the future. This ideology eventually reached its semi-paranoid revolutionary apex. Roughly a thousand years from now, the nations of Mars banned all non-essential trade and travel with Earth. This this is something kind of, um, th this is a funny little bit of grammar that I actually like. It's saying, 1,000 years from now, and then it moves into the past tense. <laughs> yeah. It's, I, yeah. I kind of like 
like it. it. It gives this eerie quality to it. Oh, you like it? Yeah, I okay. like it personally. Okay. All right. Hey, Lady Lucifer. Hey, Lou. They've been sub for five months, and they just say Warmans. They want they want the new Warrens. <laughs> um, I was like, I, I'm kind of thinking like. I mean, anytime Fred and I do anything together, you're kind of like, you're kind of getting one, really, if you think about it. <laughs> like, I, I mean... Well, well, we... we I, I'd like to do it after May when things slow down for me. And you want to do a real official one? You want to do a... Yeah. Like an actual... Yeah, okay. like a, a proper official one. Yeah. At, like after after May. Okay. Some Like probably in June, I'd like to record it. That's All right. Fine. Yeah. For Earth... It was a death sentence. Uh, oh, yeah. Sorry, I'll reread that bit. Roughly a thousand years from now, the nations of Mars banned all non-essential trade and travel with Earth. For Earth, it was a death sentence. Without the resources and industries of Mars, the terrestrial heyday would quickly devolve into a pale shadow of its former glory. Thanks, Elon. <laughs> Since a trade of essential goods continued, nobody would starve, but for every citizen of Earth, the Martian boycott meant the loss of up to three-fourths of their yearly income. Earth had no choice but to reclaim its former privileges, by force if necessary. Centuries after her political unification, Terra geared up for war. Most thinkers and fanatics Fanaticists of previous times had imagined interplanetary war as a glorious, fast-paced spectacle of massive spaceships, one-man fighters, and last-minute heroics. No fantasy could have been further from the truth. War between planets was a slow, nerve-wracking series of precisely timed decisions that spelled destruction on biblical scales. Most of the time, the combatants never saw each other. Most of the time, the combatants were not there at all. War became a duel between complicated, autonomous machines programmed to maximize damage to the other side while trying to last a little longer. Such a conflict caused horrendous destruction on both sides. Phobos, one of Mars' moons, was shattered and rained down as meteorite hail. Earth received a polar impact that killed uh, that killed off one third of its population. Finally, aim for my asshole, please. Don't worry, it only killed the bad ones. <laughs> <laughs> Barely escaping extinction, the peoples of Earth and Mars made peace and reforged a united solar system. It had cost them more than eight billion souls. Eight. Billion. <laughs> Eight billion. billion hay with a B. Star people. The survivors agreed that massive changes were necessary to ensure that such a war never occurred again. These reforms were so comprehensive that they entailed not political, economical, but biological changes as well. One of the greatest differences between the people of the two planets was that over time, they had almost become different species. It was believed that the solar system could never completely unify until this discrepancy was overcome. The answer was a new human subspecies, equally and better adapted not only to Earth and Mars, but to the conditions of most new terraformed environments as well. Furthermore, these beings were envisioned with larger brains and heightened talents, making them greater than the sum of their predecessors. Normally, it would be hard to convince any population to make a choice between mandatory steril sterilization and parenting a newfangled race of superior beings. However, memories of the war were still painfully fresh, and it was easier to implement these radical procedures in the wake of such slaughter. Any resistance to the birth of the new species did not extend beyond meager complaints and trivial strikes. In only, and again, like, uh, okay, th th to, to clarify, I don't think this person is saying that this is necessarily a good thing. <laughs> because as we will see, it's not necessarily. In only a few generations, the new race began to prove its worth. Organized as a single state and aided by the technological developments of the war, they rapidly terraformed and colonized Venus, the asteroids, and the moons of Jupiter and Saturn. Oh my god, Burkina. They can have a little eugenics as a treat. 
<laughs> as a treat. <laughs> because you've been good. Soon, however, even the domain of Seoul grew too small. The new people who inherited it wanted to go further to new worlds under distant stars. They were to become the star people. Name Nothing. drop. Well, actually, name no. Name drop. No. no. <laughs> All right. Ch chapter title name drop. Oh, okay, good. He's no hot. pee pee. No, no pee, pee pee. No pee pee. Oh, no. He's hot. Yeah. <laughs> he's a star people. There's a star people waiting in the sky. That doesn't oh, really Mike. work because Mike. the syllables are fucked up. Mike, do you yep. know about the star seeds? Is this another fucking tangent? A little bit. What is it? Yeah, what is it? What it, is it? It's this whole new sort of like it, it's a very new age spiritual movement. Um, do do you know spirit science and his his special brand of fucked up wackiness? I feel like I've heard you talk about it before. It is, yeah, he's <laughs> yeah. he's he's fucking like it's like holistic medicine bullshit almost, I, right? Like holistic. <laughs> It's so he sells young. he sells things right he sells things. Uh, th think of every fucking bullshit quartz like yeah, resin, yeah, 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 the yeah. Crystals vibration, and, yeah. the yeah, bullshit that you can think of. The yeah. dude has bought into it and monetized it. He's like like Gwyneth Paltrow. I mean, like, dude. Um, I get Gwyneth Paltrow took that shit mainstream and was like, I'm a yeah. fucking celebrity and like, I'm going to, I'm going to do this, you know? Yeah. Um, and spirit science is one of like the, um, Gwyneth Paltrow did for like, like vagina crystals, what fucking Paris Hilton did for fucking monkey JPEGs. Oh my God. Well, I, I feel like, um, spirit science is a, a gateway drug into that kind of thing for like sort of like how Gwyneth Paltrow is too it's like it, it's a softer version um and th this goes into a whole sort of like alternate history of like of, of Lemuria and um, is it like Scientology-esque uh no Scientology was a religion much a, but a completely original construction but like borrowing heavily from but the um, this guy is kind of just he's taking all these these concepts that already existed and he's tying them together in one unified like philosophy that he can shield to people. Well, there's a whole th like this is a whole thing that has gone on for decades. Hmm. Um, and like th there are there have been books written about it and like it, it's especially during um COVID, I think it started uh, gaining more traction as well. There there was a whole incident actually where a um. What was it? A very progressive lingerie company um, who, who had a lot of progressive advertisement. The owners started going like super like COVID brain rot. And then, um, you know, like it like every, every conspiracy theory you can possibly think of all being true at once, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. uh, and then he ended up like the, the CEO um, then started like he retreated. I think he's at Mount Shasta now. Isn't that soda? I swear to fucking God, Mike. That's the Juggalo soda. <laughs> that's no, that's seriously, that's the Juggalo soda, isn't it? No, that's Fago. Yeah. Fuck Fago. <laughs> oh, that's. <laughs> What? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just mentioned like Mount Shasta and you're like, that's the soda. <laughs> Mount Shasta is an actual mountain and a lot of no, um, I, I, I figured of new age. A lot of new age people end up going there for their uh, like there are lots of new age beliefs, like people that go there and have visions and shit. Yeah, the, the soda company is named after the mountain. It was... <laughs> I'm so I'm sorry. I don't know why I thought that was so funny. It was just so off the rate. Like it was such a tangent. Um, what's a what's a Suge Knight crystal? Isn't that 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 guy's a rapper, right? Suge, He's he yeah, he I, he, he makes he makes he makes like healing crystals. Suge Shung Shungite. 
No, Suge Knight. Should the guy's name is Suge Knight, Matt Mellon. He's a rapper. <laughs> He apparently makes his own fucking J.O. crystals. I didn't know this. Oh. He's Ford doing... Th- in my urethra. He's doing 30 years for a hit and run. He's not making shit. You think he can't make healing crystals from prison? He's got a lot of free time, dude. Yeah, you, you, know, what he, you know what he does. He just chugs Monster and then sells his kidney stones as <laughs> J.O. crystals. Yeah. yeah. Hey, Emmy Kasama has been subbed for four months now, and they say, hello, beans, we have a TARDIS. Well, hey, welcome to the bonus bean TARDIS. You could fill the TARDIS with so many beans because it's bigger on the inside? Yeah. (laughs) Imagine a can of beans that had more, like, that that was bigger on the inside, even more beans. That's fucking, that's what a million dollar idea. Suge Knight was a producer, not, not a rapper. Uh okay well I but he's but that that's like it sounds like a like like a stage name it doesn't sound like a you know whatever it does I'm, I I yeah. always assumed it was Shug Knight okay. the best part of this is he's trying to tell us about Shungite which is a Shungite, kind of yeah which is like a <laughs> and I just <laughs> I just fucking ignored him for like five straight minutes by repeating Shug Knight over and over. No, see, this is why I like I I laughed so hard when you were like, "Isn't that a soda?" No, I know uh, it was the same type of humor. It was... Yeah. Oh, error four hundred four, a hundred bits to say y'all should watch the video about the Lemurian cult leader they found mummified. Oh God, I have not seen that. But right, I no, it's, just that. show me more. All tomorrow's freaks. Yeah, Let's all look tomorrow's, at these, these, yeah. these freaks. Okay, so no, this fucking right. freak, this he is, again. Uh, he looks like an, a class Klas- Kuspo character. You know about that? That's the Nickelodeon animation studio from the '90s that did like Ah Real Monsters and um, okay. they they did Rugrats and shit. Okay, yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah, like think about those cartoons. I, I think was, was it was it was it the Thornberries too? They did. Yeah, right. I don't know, dude. I did um, not watch those kinds of cartoons growing up. But you seen them. But you seen them. I um, I mean I I am aware of their presence. Yeah. Um. And yeah, he—I mean, like he's wearing like leaf a leaf skirt, like he's a hula, a little hula fella. That's cute. What's mm-hmm. the um the thing going on behind him? It's like a constellation of some sort. Yeah, it's, it's fancy. That's what it is. He's got some major DSL going on though. I like how Calamity Cons is saying Mike's begging to stay on topic. This is a hilarious turn of events. Yeah, who would have thought that Mike would be the one to try to keep when, me on topic? When we, when, when he and I do shit, or when me and anybody are doing a, a thing like this on my channel, I always try to rein it in. This is not new or different. I always <laughs> try, but and I fail sometimes. Sometimes I fail, but I do try. It's not like you know. See, on my stream, I just embrace the chaos. There will like we'll have a topic and it'll be an hour and a half until we like we it will be half the stream over half the stream before we even get to it. Well, it was trial and error over time where it was like we'd done we'd done se- several streams where it was like okay we've been trying to talk about this topic for two hours like I think that w- one of the boat murdered readings we fucking read one page boat murdered in six hours. Yeah. And and I, and I was I was like okay this cannot okay come on like okay like listen yeah tangents are fine. They're, they're they're fine, but there's a fucking line, you know, like, I don't know. Mike, do, do you want to know what happens when I go off on rabbit trails? We find Froggy Song. Yeah, no, it's, it's dude, 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 it's worth it. It's worth exploring, it is. But I, yeah. uh, for, here's the other thing, too. I've wanted to see this book for fucking years. We've been talking about doing this for fucking years. And literally we, fucking like two, like two yeah. fucking years we talked about looking at this book. We yeah, yeah, we can have multiple streams for it. Um yeah, yeah, if you yeah, I mean I am I am I am down for that of course, but yeah. I just I want to see the book. <laughs> but then you have to wake up earlier more than once. <laughs> this was not easy and if we did do this again, I would I would want to like I would want to like 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 maybe like do it on my channel at some point, like alternate maybe like shared custody of of, of the book if we were going to okay. do that. Okay. But like but I, I would, you know, fucking, I mean, like, I'm here, I'm up, I did it, you know, I, <laughs> I'm fucking here, what more do you want? <laughs> I, had my, I had my coffee and everything, you know. <laughs> yeah, um, I, I, I just imagine you in, like, 30 years being like, all right, I woke up, like, and this is, this is, like, 
I, I don't know why this is what you sound like in 30 years. Like th this is, you know, 30 years of, of drinking, like you're, you're, you're primarily drinking whiskey as, as like your method of hydration. You don't got to justify like, right, it. I, I didn't even up. question it. I didn't even question Listen. it. I heard the voice. I was like, yeah, okay. That works. Look at me. I'm Mike. Come, come. <laughs> <laughs> No, you no, you like oh go on God. stage for a talk show in thirty years, yeah. and you're like, "Look, I woke up at four p.m. for you people. Do you know how hard <laughs> that is nowadays?" No, that here's is hard for me sometimes. Get. You're making me wake up at four p.m. So here's what I'm gonna do: I'm gonna go on stage. Your little floozy is gonna talk about fucking whatever for like thirty minutes, and then I'm gonna say, "Come." <laughs> And I'm going to walk off stage. <laughs> Your little floozy. Uh, he's just talking about like Katie Kirk or some shit. I, no, right? no, I'm, I'm I'm thinking of like uh, of who's who's a late night Jim Jimmy Fallon or something. Yeah, I'm Grunkle Stan. Why am I Grunkle Stan? <laughs> you are now a new day, a new pain, a new day, a new random pain. Hey, listen, your guy is going to talk for thirty minutes. I'm going to say, come, I'm going to walk off and down a whole bottle of Jack Daniels so that I can forget that I ever came on this show. If I can speak like it, if I can speak at all in a fucking year from now, honestly, I think it'd be a fucking miracle. I'm, I'm slowly breaking chat into the, the fact that like I, my throat is dying. Uh, no, like I'm, if, I'm preparing you just, them for yeah. if, you, if you just hydrate the, the best thing you can do I'd say is hydrate um, that that will help a lot more than you than you would expect just keeping your throat nice and moist I got to get really good at text to speech <laughs> like like figuring out how to do that quickly and efficiently <laughs> you know but go go Toby Fox on it um, where where you remember the time that Toby Fox joined for a whole stream and he only communicated in text to speech? Um, what what do you what? Yeah, that that happened. Uh, when when they announced Deltarune Chapter Two was dropping like that night or something. He went on somebody's his, his like somebody's like Twitch stream and did that. I think it was Fan Gamer. He was he, he was on the stream. Why like, didn't he? Did he have a reason for it? Um, well, well, they were they, they were playing through all of of Undertale as sort of a promotional thing, mm. and then like Toby Fox was there, but he only did text to speech. And then at the end of it, they revealed that like Deltarune Chapter Two was happening, and like that that it was being released for free. Okay. Um. Yeah. He hates they play, his voice. Oh, they, no, they, they played Chapter 1 of Deltarune. That's what they did. Okay. It, yeah, it was an Undertale anniversary. Right, they were like, Undertale anniversary, so we're playing Deltarune for some reason. Um, We got a, we got a, a, a fucking star. Uh, star person. I like how mm -hmm. it's some, um, you know, uh, uh, gender neutral. Star person. Star people. Star person. Because you think star, star men... Person star men would would be would be in the sky. Yeah, yeah. You think star men would be like have more? This sound more catchy, but this is just you, better. Like star people, star folk could be star folk. Folk. You guys, this is what Go A. Lewis yourself. is going to look like in a thousand years. You you know A. A. Lewis? Me? No, I don't know who that the, is. The professional, the the non professional quote maker. In this moment, like he, he's the person who coined the phrase in this moment, I am euphoric, not because of any phony God's blessing, but because I am enlightened by my own intelligence. How do you remember this shit? I, like, how do you, like, how do you remember a quote from some asshole? Like, how do you, like, how do you do this? It's my cross to bear. <laughs> you realize that I did a lot of theater growing up, right? And you have to memorize lines and stuff. Yeah, it's it just naturally happens. You just it was hold a on meme. To some stuff. Yeah. No, I know, but how did he remember it? All right, so we seen this one freak. Yeah, I like his tracksuit. Like he's gonna go jogging. <laughs> well, the, the, the top half of it looks like a tracksuit. The bottom half looks like a hula skirt. Again, I don't understand why they're leaves. All right. 
Let's um, continue. I'd Colin hit that. Is a, hmm? I'd hit that. What, like in the face? <laughs> With a <the> baseball bat? <laughs> All right, so but that's. I think that that I feel strongly like I was like, okay, I'm gonna go on Fred's stream and I'm gonna try to behave myself. I'm not gonna talk about like you know, calm or cock or anything. I'm just gonna try to you know, I'm gonna try because because probably probably Fred's audience is more sophisticated than that. So I'm gonna try to you know, yeah, 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 yeah. So because you know he's an intellectual and all this fucking bullshit. So I'm gonna try to like be an intellectual too. But now I'm realizing that the only reason that anybody came to this Twitch channel today was because they want to know whether or not we would fuck these creatures. <laughs> and like, what, so we, I think we should rate every single one of them on fuckability from like one to 10. You, you read all tomorrows because you want to posit the future of humanity. I read all tomorrows to wank. We are not the same. We are not the same. <laughs> I'm going to put his fuck ability is somewhere like a four. Smash a pass. Why don't you just smash a pass? Mike, I, I, want, I want you to think about how long <gasps> uh, that throat is and what it can do. Well, I mean, when you have a fucking like, like quarter inch penis, it's not really, it doesn't really mean it. That's meaningless to you. I think that uh, throat would snap before the collar. Uh, before the collarbone? No. What? He doesn't know. I think he doesn't we should, know. I, I think we should keep it that way. That's okay. Yeah, I I have been genetically engineered not to have a gag reflex. <laughs> tier list all <laughs> Tier list made all the pictures and then you rate them all on stream. That does that exist calamity cons or is that something that we would have to actually do? Mm. I might have to put that together. Oh my! Oh, oh my! F Fred, Fred, Fred! Yeah. We have we have to tier list these yeah. fucking these, these these creatures. Yeah. We we kind of that the idea is too good not to do that. <laughs> it's too good. All right, you want to read that? Mm -hmm. you Colonization mm -hmm. and the mechanical OADP. Oedipi? 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 Is it Oedipi? Is it supposed to be Oedipus? Well, maybe the context of the text will 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 inform us of that, right? Yeah, maybe. Uh, oh, yeah, there it is. Technological Oedipus complex. So Oedipi, you're right. Even for this, I, I, I didn't even think about that because I've never seen Oedipus put like like used that way. Well, the reason that it occurred to me is because I never seen another fucking word that looks like that outside of the word Oedipus. Like, right? O -E -D -I -P. Oedipi. Like, 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 what the it's fuck? like Oedipus is. It's like Oedip it's like the the plural. Yeah, yeah, Oedipus. it's yeah, it's fucking God stupid. Damn it. It's kind of kind of dumb, but OK. What's a name, right? So like, how do you, whatever, like, 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 what's, what, what's, what's like a common name that ends in, in, in yeah, like an S, a U.S. Lucas, right? No, that's that's an A.S. Well, it's it similar, is, yeah. but the, if if there's like two guys named Lucas, do you call them Lukai? Lukai, right? No, right? The, Bezos. Bezai. Yeah, Bezos. Bezi. Bezai. Daddy Bezi. Bezai. I. <laughs> Cletus, Cletus with two two men named Cletus would be a, a, a gaggle of Cletai. We we cloned him so that we can have multiple <laughs> Cletai. Cletai, um, a murder of of Cletai. Anyways, sorry. Yeah, we're never we're not finishing this. this nope. Stream. Are you kidding me? Nope. Even for the star people, interplanetary travel was a momentous... I, I think they meant a monumental task. A momentous task. Early minds had boggled over the problem, and fantasies such as faster-than-light travel and hyperspace emerged as the only solutions. Simply put, it was impossible to take a large number of people with enough supplies to even the closest star to make colonization feasible. The existing technologies could only slug, slug along at mere percentages... Thank you, Mike. At mere percentages of light speed, making the journey an epoch-spanning affair. Enormous generation ships were conceived and even built, but these succumbed to technical difficulties or onboard anarchy after a few cycles. Why did they put solutions in, in uh, quotation marks? Dude? Like, does that make sense? Like, because they're... Like, I don't think those were supposed to be there. The, the idea being that, like, this is a problem. Maybe it's not a problem. Oh, okay. 
one hundred bits to say a whole Chris Chan species. Uh, they're all working on it. They're all working on it. Why do we? Why do I have to be reminded of that person's existence? Ah, <laughs> uh, their existence really is a motherfucker, isn't it? Eh. That's the an understatement. <laughs> That's a fucking understatement. The you know, man, was- I I didn't. I didn't like actually register what you said until after. You know, I'm. Let's just move on. All right, let's just move on. <laughs> the solution was to first go there and make the colonists later. To this end, fast and small automated ships were sent forth to the stars. <laughs> Chats broke him. On board were semi-sentient machines programmed to replicate and terraform the destination and construct its inhabitants from the genetic materials stored on board. It's gone! A bizarre problem plagued such attempts. The first generation of humans to be manufactured sometimes developed a strange affection for the machines that made them. They rejected their own (laughs) kind and, and perished after the massive identity crisis that followed. This technological Oedipus complex was not uncommon. Nearly half of all the colony founding attempts were lost through it. Even then, however, the remaining half was enough to fill humanity's own spiral arm of the galaxy. The Summer of Man Right after mankind's colonization of the galaxy came its first true golden age. Reared by machine prophets, the survivors of the Oedipal plagues built civilizations that equaled and even surpassed their solar forebears. This diffusion across the heavens did not mean a loss of unity. Across the skies, steady flows of electromagnetic communication linked mankind's worlds with such efficiency that there was no colony that did not know about the goings-on of her distant siblings. The free flow of information meant, among other things, a vastly accelerated pace of technological growth. What couldn't be figured out in one world was helped out by another, and any new developments were quickly made known to all in a realm that spanned centuries of light. Not surprisingly, living standards rose to previously unimaginable levels. While this did not exactly mean a galactic utopia, it was safe to say that people of the, co- of the colonized galaxy lived lives in which labor, both menial and mental, was purely compulsory. Can I, can I interject I, for a second? I don't think they meant compulsory. I think they meant um, I, voluntary. So Drillhorns hey, is in the chat, and they are like, like I was kind of thinking the same thing because this, the implication here is that this kind of galactic internet would be like some kind of benefit to all of these these civilizations when like we're seeing the internet actually destroy civilization in real time right now right in, in a lot of ways like like i would i would say that that like honestly like for all the whatever positivity in the internet has brought it's also been a fucking probably like net negative i think it's a net negative um I don't know. I think that the, I think this is a terrible idea. I think they should destroy the fucking the the the, the links and like live on their own, right? Mm. Um, dooming. Yep, that's doom. Never mind. I don't <laughs> want that's doom. Am I wrong though? Someone, no, but doom. Someone said daily doom dose. Someone said Devin chat? Question mark. Did I um, miss it? But the author is here. Is he? No, they just say that, like, they just, they will randomly say that for no reason. Don't ignore, ignore them. Really? Yeah, they just, right. randomly, they just randomly say that. Hey, Mike, th- thanks for derfing for me. I feel like somebody's I don't got a, some, this stream. Somebody's got a derf. I don't, I don't even derf on my, on my own stream. It's only with you. But, but, like, is it my fault? Like, do I bring the derf out? Because I'm, because I'm doomy? me? Maybe. Maybe I just like I feel that resonation. I, I I feel that vibration and I resonate louder. Mm-hmm. Um. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. You know what it is? I'm Hearing older than you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm simply uh, older than you. <laughs> I have simply you'll catch up. suffered more. Yeah, you'll catch up. Yeah, I, I know that the author has a YouTube channel and like leaves comments on videos about the book. Yeah. Oh, is that uh, true? Yeah, no, he is active. 
Um, so that that's why I was like, oh, is is he actually here? Because that is a decent possibility. I didn't know that. During all this development, a curious phenomenon was observed. While alien life was abundant in the stars, no one had encountered any signs of true intelligence. Some attributed this to an overall rarity, while others went as far as divine influence, resurrecting religion. Regardless of the theorizing, one question went truly and utterly unanswered. What would really happen if mankind ever ran into his equals or superiors in space? Now, the next thing is an image, so I'm just going to do a PP check. Okay, we're fine. Bro, no PP. That's the, the deer owl creatures from uh, Outer Wilds. <laughs> from Outer Wilds. Yeah. I, I was, uh, my brother came over again last night to play, and he's definitely in, in, the, in the phase of playing where he's like r ranting about how good the game is. <laughs> he he's, has playing through, he's playing through the game right now. Yeah, he comes over every week and uh, he plays for a few hours. Uh, why, we, we, why does he? Ha why does he have to come play the single player game at your house? Why? What? Because we like doing it together. We like playing game. Like, dude, we grew up. With, Fred apparently um, is muted. You're. I'm muted. muted. God damn it! I'm how did muted you? Myself. How the fuck did you do that? I'm sorry. I, I have a button on my Streamlabs. Oh, yeah! Don't press that. <laughs> I <laughs> don't press that. Or my uh, my Stream Deck. Sorry. Yeah, don't press that. Not Streamlabs. I don't yeah. use Streamlabs. I figured um, what you meant, yeah. Yeah, my Stream Deck. Um, no, my, my brother comes over every week to play Outer Wilds. And like we grew up playing, uh, like one person would be on the console playing and the other person would be watching. We did that all the time. Yeah. We loved it. Yeah, it's it's one of the things that we love doing together. So he comes over and he uh, plays Outer Wilds and, and I watch and we, we just chat and have a good time. And it's fun. Okay. Yeah. Pretty wholesome. Yeah, my brother is like a better version of me. <laughs> mm. You're saying that because um, well, he, he he you were you were the prototype. You said right? I'm his prototype. Yeah, yeah. bro, a brototype, <laughs> a brototype. Yeah. So Two we were star. saying that this looks like the thing from from Outer Wilds. Yeah, I I see it. I see it. Just barely. I Two star people watch a holographic movie as they lounge under the remnants of their colonized world's indigenous flora. For them, it is a life of continual bliss. Every movement is pure bliss. After the dimensional merge, it's gotta be pure bliss. Why do they do a bat signal of this thing? Like, what's the point of that? <laughs> it's a holographic movie. All right. It's hologram. It's cool. Okay. Against the sky, right. though? Is that probably, yeah, probably hard yeah. to fucking see that? Yeah. yeah. An early warning. During those times, a small discovery of immense implications warned humanity that it might not be alone. On a newly colonized world, engineers had stumbled across the re remains of a puzzling creature considered so because it had every hallmark of terrestrial animals on an alien planet. Justifiably named Pandoravis Pandora, the colossal fossil belonged to a bird-like <laughs> creature with enormous claws. Chozos! More like Lorenz. <laughs> Later research determined it to be a highly derived therizinosaur from a lineage of er herbivorous dinosaurs that died out millions of years ago on Earth. While every other large land animal on that colony world had three limbs, a copper-based skeletal system, and hydrostatically operated muscles, Pandoravis was a typical terrestrial vertebrate with calcium-rich bones and four extremities. Finding it there was as unlikely as finding an alien creature in Earth's own strata. For some, it was irrefutable proof of divine creation. The religious resurgence, fueled at first by mankind's apparent loneliness in the heavens, uh, got even more intensified. Others saw it differently. Pandoravis had shown humans that entities, powerful enough to visit Earth, take animals from there and adapt them to an alien world, were at large in the galaxy. Considering the time gulf of the fossil itself, the mysterious beings were millennia older than humanity when they were capable of such things. 
The warning was clear. There was no telling what would happen if mankind suddenly ran into this civilization. A benevolent contact was obviously preferred and even expected, but it paid to be prepared. Silently, humanity once again began to build and stockpile weapons, this time of interplanetary potency. There were terrible devices, capable of novaing stars and wrecking entire solar systems. Do, 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 do. What is that? The, the, the end times music from Outer uh, Wilds. Uh -huh. Sadly, uh -huh. even these preparations would prove to be ineffectual in time. Uh, just you know, that's a, honestly a very uh, compelling I, kind of an idea, I think, mm -hmm. for a sci-fi uh, book, right? Yeah. Uh, so that, okay, so he was describing a Therizinosaurus, but like, dude, that is not what they fucking look like, right? A reconstruction of Pandoravis shows the creature's rake-like claws, which dug furrows in the soil to find its food. Opportunistic local animals walk alongside Pandoravis looking for morsels left over from its feasting. Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, like, why did it... Like, uh, the, the same thing happens to me as I walk down the street. Mood me IRL. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a, a, a fucking like exo, not, not what the fuck is it called, uh, paleo art snob, and tell you right now that this is not what Therizinosaurus looks like. Although maybe it's a Therizinosaurus that has been adapted to the alien planet, right, over millennia. Mm -hmm. That's what I was thinking. And it's kind of adapted, like it's become more. Um, it was ascendant of them. It probably yeah, it, yeah. It's just don't listen to me. That's what it said. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, your reference that there is an Osaurus is Ark Survival Evolved. Yeah, but shut up. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, but God. shut up. Um, coo. Coo, 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 coo. The first contact was bound to happen. The galaxy, let alone the universe, was simply too big for just a singular species to develop intelligence in. Any delay in contact only meant a heightening of this eventual culture shock. In humanity's case, this culture shock meant the complete extinction of mankind as it had come to be known. Almost a billion years old, the alien species known as Ku were galactic nomads traveling from one spiral arm to another in epoch-spanning migrations. During their travels, they constantly improved and changed themselves until they became masters of genetic and nanotechnological manipulation. With this ability to control the material world, they assumed a religious, self-imposed mission to remake the universe as they saw fit. Powerful as gods, the Ku saw themselves as the divine harbingers of the future. This dogma was rooted in what had been a benevolent attempt to protect the race from its own power. However, blind, unquestioning obedience had made monsters of the Ku. And yes, I know sometimes it's pronounced harbinger. It, I, it, it's both. I've heard both. To them, humanity, with all of its relative glories, was nothing more than a transmutable subject. Within less than a thousand years, every human world was destroyed, depopulated, or, even worse, changed. Despite the fervent rearmament, the colony that despite the fervent rearmament, the colonies could achieve nothing against its billion year old foes save for a few flashes of ephemeral resistance. Humanity, once the ruler of the stars, was now extinct. However, Good. humans <laughs> were not. Humanity, humanity was now extinct. This was generally considered a positive change. Humanity, <laughs> once ruler of the stars, was now extinct. This is good for Bitcoin. <laughs> Bitcoin fixes this. <laughs> it's a good thing. It's a good thing Ethereum has a functionality that helps deal with this problem. Mm. <laughs> can can I see the fat, plumpy, fucking dinosaur again, please? Yeah, I just really. He's just so. F I I like how he he's like plump and mirthful. 
Mm. You know, you guys like how Mike has very quickly undergone a uh, a character development of this isn't accurate, this isn't real. To well, he, I kind of like I kind of like his dumpy. He, he, he's 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 plump, like he's pleasantly plump. Like look at his fat jowls, like he looks like Richard Nixon. <laughs> Mike, do you want the Dino Dumpy? Uh, you know, like I noticed, like the tail. The, okay, so like it, it had a tail, right? Mm -hmm. But on this alien planet, the tail de evolved. Like it's gone now, and then it's, it's been replaced with like a fat, sussy Dumpy. Yeah, but the plumpy Dumpy. Like a plumpy, yeah, you know, like 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 fucking like twerk twerkable, highly twerkable Dumpy. Guys, you said the like, thing. We have an emote for that. Um, there it is. <laughs> You know you not know to I, not to hmm? upload a, a fucking twerking Amogus, right? Because they'll oh yes, they'll absolutely, <clears throat> okay. yeah, of course. Did you know that I've only ever played like six rounds of Among Us? I've played zero. I've, so you're, you're more a gamer than I am. <laughs> oh my god, the B. Um, B. Ninety nine dollar dinosaur cloaca. Oh no! Don't 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 engage with that, please. What? Don't engage. <clears throat> what? Okay. Don't Not engage. Engaging. Don't engage. Disengaging. Uh, let let me let me do a quick penis check on this next image. Uh that's okay, the Q. I think we're good. Q and yeah, on. that's the that's the Q. The Q the Q Q Q Q and on, dude. Um, someone in chat said an entire race of Q from Star Trek. So they're like I mean, bugs. no no but no the Q are a race the Q continuum. Yeah. They just call him Q because that's how he introduces himself. Uh, it, uh, it's similar. It's, a bunch of, it, it, it's kind of sim I, I guess it's kind of similar to what they're describing in this book too. Right? Like kind of just uh, uh, fucking omni om omnipotent basically, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It, so this his, is a very symbolic. Right, so he's like a dragonfly, right? It's a symbolic piece of art, right? A dragonfly and his penis is prehensile. And it's wrapped around what looks like a rifle of some kind. Uh, yeah. Which, which, like, why would it have that? Like, I don't know. The fuck? Well, we have a description. Okay. Coup triumphant in the fall of man. To his left floats a nanotechnological drone. To the right, a genetically modified tracing creature. The fuck does that mean? Probably, like, tracking. I don't know. I, I'm going to be honest. I, I love this this piece of art. It is beautiful. Like, like this, this is artist so, so is cool, very evocative. But... And I mean, like, I, I just, I get, I guess he has the rifle because he took it from, 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 from the man, like from the, the human. Yeah. Because like, why would it have that? You know. Um. So they, okay. they're, they're fucking, they're fucking gross, dude. So they only have four wings, like that's their entire physiology. Four wings and like a Jar Jar Binks head, basically. But they're just obscenely like technologically advanced. Misa are gonna genocide humans. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever tried to just say like talk like a gungan in like in, in a normal voice uh misa gonna genocide humans like that yeah. like just like yeah. in your actual mm -hmm. um i want darth jar jar to be real blind archer <laughs> darth jar jar do you know that do you know that theory uh, I, I remember hearing some dumb shit like that. Yeah. Yeah. Like Jar Jar is the actual Phantom Menace. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's a very fun theory. Um, yeah. Slip, and slippery Elm has touched on the point I'm making. Huh? I'm going to do the Jar Jar voice. Oh, this sounds, yeah, <laughs> you, you get it. Uh, oh, this sounds racist. Yeah. Right, right, right. Um, no, c c cause, uh, what the fuck? That is is an idea. The Darth Jar Jar is an idea that sadly I would not put past George Lucas. Yeah. I see that's the thing though, is I the problem that the reason that I know that Darth Jar Jar is not actually something that he thought of is because I like the idea of Darth Jar Jar. <laughs> and there's no saying, way you're saying it's too good of an idea for him yes well listen you the like it because yeah, it's fucking it, funny but, that's why dude, you like it you, they, dude yeah. he fucking called them the goongas he the made them and he called them the goongas 
Somebody said it's it's fictional against or it's it's racist against a fictional race, but I mean if you're <laughs> It's pretty easy to understand that the Gungans are meant to be like Caribbean islanders, like, yeah. like the, the accent and the. I, I mean, I don't, I don't know what else. The accent, I guess. I, yeah, I, f- I feel like that's kind of obvious, right? Yeah, I mean, like, it's, I, it's a. I, I say this a lot, but I feel like that's something that's not even controversial to say. No, it isn't. It's de- definitely. He was like, "What? Well, well, it was like George. What do you? What kind of like?" What cultural flavor are you going for with the Gungans? And he was like, I don't make them Jamaicans. Make them Jamaican. And they were like, okay, that's okay. Okay. So apparently the Jar Jar voice was the voice the actor would use to read to his kids. Okay. That see, like that makes more sense. He had a breakdown when people started freaking out over the voice. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. That makes that man that's so sad oh so he was like not in, in other words instructed to, to do that voice but you will you will but, but understand our where we're coming from because he didn't just do that voice the entire race of gungans had right. that ac- had that accent right D- did did they just like they say oh he, he does that voice now all of them do that voice like how did how did that work i i guess if if it's true that like uh, maybe maybe so what probably happened is they had the you know they had the actor come in for uh, an audition he did the voice they were like okay we like that um let's just yeah apply that to everybody the whole race Other is sound like that fucking differently okay yeah the that's act- not how okay, i so remember actor- it i remember boss nass being like me so gonna go to me about the yeah. doka puka doka puka doka doka jerk chicken doka doka like wait what the fuck yeah. like, no like they he, all they, he was doing it too yeah like, he was similar- like straight up yeah they're trying to gaslight the- us dude I, they are <laughs> the yeah. fucking chat um the oh god the, the poor actor who played jar jar got so much shit yeah 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 so unfair he's just doing a job dude yeah. boss nas said poopa stinker and then motorboated <laughs> <laughs> god damn it <laughs> uh... <laughs> god damn it intonation was the actor's oh, okay man god I... The poor actor got so much shit for like yeah. Jar Jar because everyone was like Jar Jar is the worst. We have to hate the actor. Yeah, like, come on, use your fucking use the your actor. fucking brain, people. He's doing Jesus a job. Christ, use your fucking and, brain, dude. God, and then like George, like and every while everyone was busy hating on the actor who played Jar Jar, fucking. Like George Lucas hoisted his goiter and got out before anyone could realize that he was the problem. Uh, hold on a second. I'm waiting. Sorry, bud. You're good. You're good. Uh, all right. So we got this one fucking freak. I love this art. I love this 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 picture. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um. Uh, hey, Mike. Yeah. It's been another hour, and you know what that means. He really fucking does this every hour. Yes. He really, he really does this. Yes. He really fucking. Yes, does I do. This. He really does this. Okay. So five yeah. minutes every hour. We looked at two pictures. Yeah. We looked at two fucking men. We looked at yeah. two fucking freaks. Two freaks. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's time for stretchy leggy. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna everyone. Pee. Yeah, my right. I'm, I swear to God, this is like I'm so laissez-faire about streaming. I'm going to just destroy Mike. Lice says fairy. That's how you supposed to pronounce that, dude. Fair. What? Um. Yeah, I I mean I'm I'm from a school of of discipline where uh like I mean in my experience. If you do a fucking, if you put a BRB screen up for like 10 seconds, like 50% of the audience leaves. I was going to mention this um, at the end of this break, but something I wanted to point out, I've been doing these BRBs every time. And I like, I was a little bit worried that I would see a significant like chunk of people leave every time I did it. But people leave over the last few months i've still been consistently doing it because i suspected that the people who consistently come to stream come because they that they are there for like the actual content of the stream mm-hmm. um 
and now I I get anywhere between what what now four hundred and um like five hundred and fifty viewers mm -hmm. on the regular, mm -hmm. and I lose maybe ten or twenty. Which, by the way, screen. Fred, I I I want you to know, um, you have done so good on Twitch, uh, like <laughs> I and listen, it took me it took me years to get to get to have that that kind of like average audience. Well, to be fair, so, I think a lot of like um. A lot of people came in uh, from your streams, and then a lot of people also know me from YouTube. So it's not like I'm starting from zero like you did. But I'm still, um, I'm still taking the opportunity to say I'm, I'm proud of you, buddy. Oh, thank you. And uh, thank you. Um, I'm, you make it, you're making I'm just, some very, very good stuff over here, man. I'm just so glad that people enjoy this kind of offbeat content that I do, where I, it's not exactly down the rabbit hole, but I'm so glad that people are are enjoying what I'm doing over here so much too. Cause I love it. I, I, I love doing this, just coming on and sharing odd things with stream. Um, yeah, no, it's honestly, it's the best kind of content. Like for me too, like I really, I enjoy doing this kind of thing, like way more than actually playing video games at this point. <laughs> yeah. It's, right. I mean, I just love sharing things with people. So this is, everything that I want to do. <laughs> uh, okay, so we're going to pee? There are, there are some times when I want to play a game on stream. Um, there's still a part of me that wants to uh, play Total Warhammer and let people spend bits to name a unit after themselves. <laughs> I, I, I really want to do something like the vampires and be like, hey, you see that zombie getting its shit wrecked? That's me! <laughs> um... Yeah, I saw you doing XCOM once. I, I think it was like the only time I saw you streaming a game. It was XCOM. yeah. I think like games just don't quite fit my personality though on my mm -hmm. streams. It's mm -hmm. it's not quite right. It's not quite the right fit. That's it's okay. Yeah, I, I was thinking uh, Dakinar. It might be fun to try it when uh, when Immortal Empires drops for a Warhammer three. Yeah, or Mortal Empires. It's I think it's just Mortal Empires. It's because it's jet all oh, but but charity with a heartfelt comment <laughs> always but charity Say, fred yeah. it's it's because it's genuine nothing feels scripted or overcooked it's hard to find on twitch oddly enough really i i mean i i try to be discerning about what i share and what i say but i'm i'm glad that i i guess i'm glad that um i'm glad that it's obvious how earnest it is um, yeah, Plico, Plico Plico with 500 bits to say, name a star people after me. There's a star. Plico Plico. Something in the star sky. Star Plico. Well, they're called star people, so star Plico star is Plico. not that far of a stretch, yeah. right? <laughs> um, well, hey. Mike. Mm. What were we going to say? Innocent. A hey, Atris. Innocent jabroni Mike lover to extremist Fred Knudsen enjoyer pipeline <laughs> Extre extreme extremist Ex well you, you saw you, you've seen all of the political twitch streamers that are subscribed to me now <laughs> yeah true <laughs> <laughs> like Germa <laughs> um who is your favorite type of evolved human so far I don't I mean out of the two uh I guess this yeah, one right okay I'm, I'm gonna go piss all right all right so, that go, was everyone everyone get up you, hey, Mike, you're starting stream at your normal time, right? And you want time before you do your stream. Correct? He's already gone. He's prob like he's probably pissing as I speak. Everyone, get up, stretch your legs, stretch your arms, get yourself a sippy, and I'll see you all in about five minutes.
Ika Pika, if I see you apologizing for not making art one more time, I'm going to take away your tea privileges. <laughs> Ika P I can't believe Ika Pika comes into my chat and apologizes for not making free fan art. <laughs> like, what the shit? Ika Pika, we love you. Thank you for all the cool art, though, that you've given us. It's it's fucking awesome. I so cute. They very make they make very cute art, right? Yeah, I have you. Oh my god, did you see the uh, the fucking at um the manga that that they made the animated manga? No, animated Me, for yeah for for all for for the Lori Tran. Let me see. Let me go find it real quick. Hello, everyone. We're back. Anim animated. Yeah, I that I literally showing him. Oh yeah, there there's a titty slap. Um here we go. I spent like three days on this shitty mangoes. <laughs> Thank you. That is what Ika, that is how Ika Pika oh. described it. Oh, it's like an RPG. Uh, oh, it's like a yeah, visual here, novel. Me, yeah. Yeah. Uh here. Check check this. Check this. Uh there's not really a way for me to make it bigger without... Oh, you know what? Can I... Is that even going to work? What if I... Hold on. Hey, it does... Okay, that works. Um, What if I am on this side? Okay, there we go. That'll do. Oh, there. Glad you... <laughs> Thank you, Onesama. I'm glad you let me bring Lil Fella here. <laughs> oh, no. After your summoning practice, I thought some tea would help you feel better. I'm gonna get some tea now. <laughs> <laughs> Alpha male? Alpha. Okay, so a while ago, we looked at some of those alpha male. Um, like, remember I was telling you about the Twitter accounts? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. The alpha male Twitter um, accounts and shit, yeah. Yeah, and they, there's one where it's like you see a girl sitting at a table of like, how do you approach her? And it, like, it, it's just a whole bunch of. Oh, dudes, like, no. I, yeah, I get it. I get it. I get it. Yeah, now. yeah. <laughs> Make potentially. <laughs> you must know that I made potentially millions of dollars by selling monkey JPEG NFTs. Oh, was this your seat? Sorry, woman. I'm it's a uh, I, I'm an alpha here. It's pickup culture, is, is what it's yeah. called. Yeah, like like pickup pickup artistry, right? I'd like you to look at the the I different see options. And I, I, <laughs> Dominate, I see. step on CBT, or crush scrotum. Well, I mean, two of them are, are very similar, right? Yes, um, the two on the bottom are quite similar. Mm. Um, ready to have a two D dick. <clears throat> You're gonna be the seat. <laughs> so we we had a <laughs> simp chair. Oh man, I um, I okay. Uh, we were reading about sarcasm in the SCP wiki, and the <sighs> uh, we're not ending stream. I just really wanted to show this to Mike. By the way, you guys. Um, we realized that uh, Harpy Lauren was way too close to this god of sarcasm that was being described. So she's I remember now the, a meat goddess. I remember the the god of sarc sarcasm. Yeah, it's 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 like many levels deep of of meme and shit, right? Dude, yeah, like that's the thing. That's something that I love about my streams. Hmm, tasty leaf water. That's something that I love about my streams is that like everything is so steeped in memes at this point, but everything is also very accessible. Yeah, yeah. I feel like people can come in and not know what a meme is, but still be like, wow, that's cursed as shit, like and acceptable on it. It's engaging on its face. Dude, yeah, the the, the pickup artist stuff is gonna be real fun. I'd like to oh, yeah. um 
I'd like I'd like to be a part of that if you if, if you want if, to. If you, okay, I because I, 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 that shit's very funny to me. Mm-hmm. But there's one I'm gonna show you. I don't want to show you now because I don't want to get fucking like derailed again. But there's one I'm gonna I'm gonna message you later. You're you're gonna you're gonna fucking laugh so hard. Okay. Okay. Get, the, the, the semen re- It's it's more a semen retention thing, but it's like okay. you know, same same like universe, right? Mm. Same um same realm. Mm. Uh, all right so we've seen the queue that's where we were the queue yeah and uh all right so they've they've eliminated humanity from the galaxy in this universe um but yet humans remain it's almost an oxymoron mm-hmm. isn't it yeah uh but but okay but right. humanity man, as a civilization is done but humans still exist yeah man extinguished look at that in like the dark souls font <laughs> like the elder elder ring <laughs> elder ring font man extinguished thank you for showing my art again fat nuts my heart goes funny feeling says Ika Pika <laughs> well you did a great job on that yeah they they yeah they did fantastic the worlds of humanity gardens of terraformed paradise seemed strangely empty to the coom Often, there were no raw materials available other than people, their cities, and a few basic niches of ecology populated by genetically modified animals and plants from Earth. This was because humans had erased the original alien ecologies in the first place. Offended by another race trying to remake the universe, the Ku set forth to punish these infidels by using them as the building materials of their vision. While this led to a complete extinguishing of human sentience, it also saved the species by preserving its genetic heritage in a myriad of strange new forms. Populi- populated by ersatz humans, now in every guise from wild animal to pets to genetically modified tools, Ku reigned supreme for 40 million years on the worlds of our galaxy. They erected kilometer-high monuments and changed the surfaces of entire worlds apparently to whim. One day, they departed as they had come, for theirs was a never-ending quest, and they would not, could not stop until they had swept through the entire cosmos. Behind them, the Ku left a thousand worlds, each filled with bizarre creatures and ecologies that had once been men. Earsets! It, ersatz is it just means fake. I know it's just funny. It's a funny word. I think you're the fake human around here. What? You're Fuck com- that shit. You're comparing yourself to me. Ha! You're not even good enough to be my fake. No, you're the fucking fake. You fucking faker. You filthy fucking faker. Fuck you. Nah, let's Hold go toe to toe, mano Hold a on. mano. This, this reminds me. This reminds me of something. Hold on. Oh, whoop. This. I Have you seen this? No, I don't think so. Okay, this is incredible. Let me see. Oh, god damn it. I'm going to be talking shit about you later, but I want to do it right. So why don't you tell me your pronoun? <laughs> <laughs> Unlike you blue-haired liberals, I don't <laughs> What? Everybody has pronouns. I don't. You will refer to me only by my name. Shadow the Hedgehog. At least he gets the concept. Pronoun police. You said he, which is not Shadow the Hedgehog. (laughs) 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 Oh, that's fucking good, dude. Right? That's fucking good. Blue haired liberal. (laughs) That's fucking amazing. Did you see the one with the Uno on the Xbox? Oh, of course. But with, Wait, oh, with, you mean so, uh, the with, Sonic one? Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. I am I not. Give me I, a second let's, to look I, it up. I mean, if you want, I mean, like you know, I will. It, it'll take a second, you know. Yeah, Sonic and Shadow Xbox uh, uh, Uno, whatever. Probably you'll find it. I love the original of that. You have Uno. Yeah, well, they'll click the first. This one? The first one. Yeah, yeah click, okay, yeah, got yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna love it. Everyone has Uno Blue Hedgehog. It came free with your fucking chaos. I have seen Xbox. this. I didn't uh. get it. 
and I have the oldest Xbox. <laughs> <from the band. laughs> oh, you don't. I got mine on day one, you fucking faker. <laughs> well, mine didn't have it. You have Uno, you fucking dick. I don't have it. You fucking. <laughs> you have Uno. <laughs> I don't fucking have Uno, mother faker. Mother faker. I don't have faker. Poor. It's a I don't free card game. They don't even charge nine, people for ten, it. <laughs> Or eleven. You don't know what <laughs> fucking thing. thing. It's Uno. It's Uno. free. It's free. <laughs> My fucking god. <laughs> it's free. <laughs> Isn't that good? Isn't that so good? All right, I'm sorry. So, so back to the to the book. <laughs> uh, so anyway, back to the book. Yeah. Uh, I, I want to oh. say um, so. Uh, one of the things that I think I'm I'm kind of disappointed by is what I was looking forward to was seeing, um, how a a a extraterrestrial like diaspora of humanity right would have mm -hmm. to naturally, uh, you know, through through I guess natural selection and evolution would adapt to new worlds and and change. Uh, physiologically, right, to meet challenges of specific environments, like the way evolution typically works. Mm -hmm. That's what I kind of what I, I thought this book was, but it kind of looks like what it, it's a little bit like it's a little bit more of a cop out where it's like aliens did it. Like it turned right. out to just be I, like aliens did it, and I'm a little bit like I can like, see that. I'm like I a little think bummed that you did that, that you know? so that we can get more body horror. -y. Okay, that then I respect, but I mean, like maybe there was a way it touches on that later. All right, all right, yeah. Man extinct. Oh, yeah. Uh, behind them, the coup left a thousand worlds, each filled with bizarre creatures and ecologies that had once been men. Most of them perished right after their caretakers left. Others lasted a little longer to succumb to long-term instabilities. On a precious few worlds, descendants of people actually managed to survive. In them lay the fate of the species, now divided and differentiated beyond recognition. Sounds great. And the monument that they left. A mile-high coup pyramid towers over the silent world that once housed four billion souls. Such structures are the hallmark of coup, and they can be seen on every habitable world they pass through. All right. Worms. Their world lay under a scorching sun, its intensity made monstrous through the interventions of the bygone coup. A worm? The, a worm? The surface lay littered with husks of dead cities, baking endlessly like shattered statues in a derelict oven. Yet life remained on this unforgiving place. Forests of crystalline plants blanketed the surface, recycling oxygen for the animal life that teemed underground. One such species, barely longer than the arms of their ancestors, was the sole surviving vertebrate. Furthermore, it was that planet's last heir of the star people. Distorted beyond recognition by genetic modification, they looked for all the world like pale, overgrown worms. Tiny, feeble feet and hands modified for digging were all that betrayed their noble heritage. Aside from these organs, all was simplified for the life underground. Their eyes were pinpricks, they lacked teeth, external ears, and the better half of their nervous system. The, the lives of these ersatz people Again? did not extend beyond, yes, digging aimlessly. If they encountered food, they devoured it. If they encountered others of their kind, they sometimes devoured them, too. But mostly, they mated and multiplied, and managed mm. to preserve a single shred of their humanity and their genes. In time, it would do them good. Really? All right, we need to do a penis inspection. The whole thing is a penis, dude. All right. Well, I'm seeing a vagina. I'm yeah. I'm, um, I'm seeing. I'm seeing a gooch. Uh, there's let a me, yeah. There's a. Let there's me just a do a, a quick. Um, there's there's also assholes down down there. Dude. Girl, that's a booty hole. Um, I'm I'm just gonna cover the vagu. They there look, the, dude. Look. They they're like manta rays, or th that's this is what manta rays look like. Like, look at the face, right? Yeah, a little bit. They they do look similar. Two worm parents with their young. I mean, like if you look at all of the the evolved humans in 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 uh, you know all tomorrows, 
Um, if you look at the worm human, you'll find out that it's the one most suitable to human breeding. It's oh got my. the right size. It's got the right shape. It's the right. It's in the same egg group. Barbooch and, would be great yeah. for anal. <laughs> <laughs> uh yeah i fucking hate it obviously um i mean it's got ribs like i can see it's ribs okay look you're oh. saying there are two of them the one on the left is much more tos than the one on the right yeah um mike can see it and yeah I think yeah it's it's, it's 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 a it's a it's a vagina um the the fucking their faces are like fun though like the one on the right just looks like he's having a great time yeah, uh, they're a happy family. Yeah, they're a happy family. The one mm -hmm. on the left, like, like, look at that that face. It's just like she's thinking about her her fucking grocery list. Like, she's thinking about the list. Like, she's like, oh, did I forget to put eggs on there? I gotta put eggs on there. You know, mm -hmm. um, yeah. like they're just happy. Like, I don't know. Like, this seems okay. Like, I would be a worm person. Yeah, you. <laughs> I have good news for you, then, Mike. Okay, you already are. Oh, got him. Titans. On the endless savanna of a long-extinguished colonial outpost, enormous beasts roamed supreme. More than 40 meters long by terrestrial measurements, these behemoths were actually the transmuted offspring of the star people. Several fe features be betrayed their human ancestry. They still retained stubby thumbs on their elephantine front feet, now useless for any sort of precise manipulation except for uprooting trees. You know, precise. Mm -hmm. They compensated this loss by developing their lower lip into a muscular, trunk-like organ that echoed the elephants of Earth's past. DSL. As, yum, 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 yum. as bestial as they seemed, the Titans were among the smartest of the reduced submen that remained in the galaxy. Submen? Submen. Mm -hmm. Sorry. What? No, oh, no, you said among. Oh, no, no, oh, no, no, oh, oh, no, oh. no, 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 no. Their hulking stance allowed for a developed brain, and gradually, sentience reemerged. With their lip trunks, they fashioned ornate wood carvings, erected hangar like dwellings, and even began a form of primitive agriculture. With settled life came the inevitable flood of language and literature, myths and legends of the bygone, half-remembered past were told in booming voices across the vast plains. It was easy to see that, within a few hundred thousand years, humanity could start again with these titanic primitives. Sadly, as a catastrophic ice age took over the Titans' homeworld, <laughs> the gentle Good. giants disappeared, never to return. Good. I, I'm I'm happy there's a single Wapowski. Uh okay, PP inspection. Okay, oh, no PP. Alright, this one sucks. No pee -pee. Like this fucking one sucks. Oh, you don't oh like my it? God. You don't like, like it? Like uh, I mean like in a good way, you know? Oh, okay. You know what? They're just I, like Ugh. Oh yeah, God. You know what it is? I saw these as the eyes, mm -hmm. but it the eyes are actually tiny. Yeah, they're right tiny there, in right there. there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, those are the eyes. They're itty bitty. Oh, fuck. That's so much worse. Um, this was just my PE teacher in high school. <laughs> he is he like a little Rogan esque to you? Mm -hmm. Like he's a little Rogan. I'm seeing like, it. Yeah, he. It? Yeah, he. He's a little F cider. Um. He, he looks like he's ab about to ask you um, uh, about some herbal remedies. I do enjoy the idea that this alien race only did this to, 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 to people to be spiteful. Yeah. Basically, like, like, does, does it, like, this was done deliberately to be spiteful, I guess. Like, that's not even, like, that's, on second thought, that that is kind of cool. Um, Where are his nips? Why do we, we don't, we don't, I don't think we need to see his nips, right? No, I, I like how you asked a question and then immediately said, you know what? I don't need to know. Wait, wait what, what? I appreciate I, that. What did like, I ask? Wait, you said, where are his nips? And then you immediately oh, yeah, said, yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. think we need to see his nips. Uh, smash a pass on this guy. Um, 
Well, I think we should do a, a scale of one to ten because, like, at the end of the day, like you know, you take it where you could get it, right? So I think probably it's going to be. I'm putting it like a two. Like this could be like a good like you know like like slam pig. I, I guess like a slam a slam elephant, if you will. Okay. Okay. Um. Now, but though, dude, dude, you see his lower lip. Yeah. Okay. Look at his lips. This, this, and the blunt. <laughs> The uh -huh. top of his head. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his lips. <laughs> okay, I'm done. It's still, it, it's, it, it's still amazing how perfect that is. Like, I, you, you could play that for every single one of these fucking things so far. Yeah. Like, just keep, right? like, keep fucking playing that. Uh, it's just too. That's too good. I'm, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to have it on stream for like. Put like, it on the for, sound for the board. Time, for the next Put time we do the, the stream, I'm going to have to have it board. on the soundboard. Yeah, yeah, it has to go on the soundboard. Predators and prey. Devolved predators were common among humanity's feral worlds. Most of the time, they resembled the vampires, werewolves, and goblins of bygone lore, hunting mm -hmm. equally subhuman prey with a combination of derived weaponry. Some had enormous heads with large, killing teeth. Others tore their victims apart with talon-like feet, but the most common kinds bore modified fingers and thumbs, bristling with razor-sharp claws. The most efficient of these predators lived on one of mankind's first off-world colonies. In addition to paw-like hands with switchblade thumbs, they also had gaping, tooth-studded jaws on disproportionate heads with large, sensitive ears. All of these served to make them the dominant predators of on their home planet. They ran the prairies, stalked the forests, and ranged through the mountains in pursuit of different people. Herbivorous sal saltate wait saltators, saltators, really really salty with -like, potatoes, dude, with bird-like legs. While their prey lapsed into, into complete animosity, the hunters managed to keep the spark of intelligence alive in their evolutionary honing. Uh, penis inspection? <laughs> oh. oh, he's good. He's good. Um, wow. He's like a leopard man? <laughs> oh my god, this this is just Harry Potter and Leopard walk up to Koo. This is just uh somebody's fucking fursona. Like I don't even know what like this is all tomorrow's what no, this is like San Diego Furcon, dude. Like what the fuck are you talking about? Um medieval <laughs> looking fella. Yeah, he does look like some medieval like wildlife depictions. Um oh, he's yeah. also got like a significant like like fucking like like gape for like his mouth. Like he could fucking like really slam down a hog like if he needed to. Um, I'm not sure why I chose to make that observation, but I did. Um, also, isn't it weird that he doesn't have a tail? Don't you feel like he should have a tail? Yeah, his posture is 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 rough. He's got a bad posture. He's probably probably has some back pain going on. Right. I yeah, that that's what you're you look at this thing and the first thing you go is you know he looks like he has he needs some lumbar support. Oh, somebody in chat said it and I was like yeah look he's like look 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 look, look. he's he's not like quite upright I guess he I guess he's kind of like bipedal and quadrupedal like he can go between both like when he wants to run and, and attack something he could he could do that right uh, he could yeah he could kind of go switches back and forth um his fucking face though he looks like I don't. Dude, I can't place it. Like, like, like a children's book. Like, where the wild things are, or something. We found Nigel like, Thornberry. Okay, we did. We found uh, who? 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 Who is it? Lady Gaga. We found Lady Gaga. What? Um, you told me Lady Gaga sounds like Nigel Thornberry when she sings, didn't you? No, like, like you think of bad romance. Ra 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 ra. It kind of sounds like Nigel Thornberry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Smashing. That's fucking amazing. Is he um? Yeah, is he like? Is he pogging? It's a soy pog. It's a soy it, a soy pog. Yeah, it's a soy like, pog. Oh my god! New human just dropped. Soy pog. Dude. I gotta get to that new human. Um. Yeah. <laughs> get on down to 
human stop. <laughs> Buy the stock. Got to get a new new fucking human. He's um he just sucks, man. Like I really I really fucking hate him. Um so let's move on. I mean like he could yeah, I mean like he he could he his throat and his mouth has like significant capacity. I think. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. So you all oh, but the teeth. Got to watch out a, for scraping. That's a big problem. So I think I'm going to have to play some like out of 4 or 5 on the um you know, you just the, be worried about the bite down. The smash o meter. We're going to put him at a 4. Where are you where would you put him, Fred? On the smash o meter. Um I mean, you do you do the bag over the head technique and you know there's oh and then just pretend that he's like a regular leopard it's the nose yeah it's a problem it's the yeah. nose yeah yeah it's uh it's 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 disproportionate everything about his his face is disproportionate yeah yeah he's just he, yeah. he's pl plus he's gonna just scrape scrape it like a carrot dude with those teeth <laughs> fucking christ <laughs> So we put, right, put uh, him on. I give him like a like a three, a two. We, we, I, I, I give him a four. I, I, I give him. I give him a, a three. All right, not bad, not bad. He's a middle morph anamorph. He is. He is. You're right. He Do we have is. some like rat information in chat? Rat from we got the yeah rat girl. Yeah, rat girl. Yeah, he's that. So uh, another penis check. Okay, I, th I think we're fine. No penis here. Like, <laughs> there, there is a surprising amount of penis. <gasps> He's got like a tiny dumpy, like a small mm. dumpy, right? Mm. This uh, but it, he got, uh, the, he got the horse face. Yeah, the hor the horse face. Um, what the fuck? Oh man! Like again, I'm reminded of another Nickelodeon cartoon where somebody just fucking looked like that. Like, was it like Hey Arnold or something? Like, what the fuck? Like, who looked <laughs> like this? Like, what it's cartoon like, am I am I thinking of? It, it's like if Ed, Ed, and Eddie were allowed to run for fifty seasons. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The de or evolution like, of Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Or like if Mike Judge did sci-fi. Uh, Bobby. This is yeah, it's idiocracy. Um, oh no! I, I wasn't thinking about that of, as sci-fi. I, I was mm. thinking of like I, I like this feels like King of the Hill if Mike Judge just w kept creating for thousands of years. It, eventually, he's like he starts creating shows that are relatable to like three people on a yeah, backwater yeah. moon. Yeah. Yeah. Or like, like they completely get it. They they it resonates with them and is is a very is like the Simpsons to those three people. Were you the one who showed me like the saddest Sim Simpsons intro? Uh ever ever made? Maybe. Do you know the one I'm talking about? What happened? What happened in it? Just, I mean, like okay, worth it. Segue. Just go go to YouTube and type in the like the, the saddest Simpsons intro. Like you'll you'll get it. Saddest Simpsons intro. Oh, I've seen this. Yeah, yeah, yeah I yeah, will yeah, never yeah. forget you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, what's up, Caps Lock? Spliced, the movie Spliced with the subtle body horror. Well, I don't know if there's... I would not use the word subtle here, but I did... I have seen that movie. Um, he's kind of got like a... This is like... When I wake up at like noon and like I haven't had my meds yet and I have to piss. <laughs> Oh, I gotta make it to the pissing tree. That this is just you. Pi yeah, that's that's. The, I'm, I'm on my way to the pissing tree. Piss haste. I like his yeah. bird legs. I like his um his hair. He's kind of it's, it's it reminds you like a troll doll in a way. Like remember those troll dolls? It's the hair. Yeah, it, it's the hair in the face. And his protruding uh, mouth is very fun. Right. Yeah. Yum, 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 yum. Me at three a.m. when I'm caught at the refrigerator, just eating like a block of cheese. Like you're just eating a block of cheese. Like you're not even like, using a knife. Not, not even bite. shredded cheese. Just yeah. a block. Mantelopes. <laughs> not all devolved people oh, lapsed so into, into complete bestiality. Some held on to their minds while losing all of their physiological advantages to the genetic meddling of the coup. A singular species was a prime exemplar, 
They had been bred as singers and memory retainers, Semen acting retainers? much like living recorders during the reign of Ku. Huh? Semen, Semen retainers? retainers? Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sorry. That, that's why they're so smart, comparatively. Right, because their tea counts are off the charts. Right. When their masters left, they barely survived, reverting into a quadrupedal stance and occupying a niche as grazing herd animals. The change, this change was so abrupt that the newly evolved mantelopes endured only due to the forgiving sterility of their artificial biosphere. The mantelopes, equipped with full, if slightly numbed, human minds and completely disabled animal bodies, lived agonizing lives. <laughs> they could see and understand the world around them, but due to their bodies, they could do nothing to change it. For centuries, <laughs> That's just me! What are you talking about? <laughs> That's just me. What? I mean, uh, for That's centuries, my life. But... <laughs> Mournful herds roam the plains, singing songs of desperation and loss. Entire religions and oral traditions were woven around this crippling racial disability, as dramatic and detailed as any on bygone Earth. Jesus For Christ! Fortunately, the selective forces of evolution made their agony a short-lived one. Simply put, a brain was not advantageous to develop if, a, if it could not be put into good use. A dim-witted, half-minded mantelope grew up faster than a smart one and grazed just as efficiently. The mantelope's animal children overtook them in less than a hundred thousand years, and their melancholic world fell silent for good. Nothing was sacred in the evolutionary process. Dear fucking lord, that's, that's you, dismal. Do, do you know about this? Like why humans evolved larger brains? Oh, tell me. I have um, ideas, but. So, th like brains take up a, ma oh no, did I miss a sub 42 minutes ago? Yeah, like well, Deceiver I guess you 101 must hate, has you been must, subbed for You must hate that months. person. You must yeah. hate, you and must they hate said, that person completely. Yeah. God damn you it. You hate them. And they say stretch them clots out for the, for the break. Oh, the clot stretch, yeah. God, I'm so sorry. I think it happened like right at the break. I they hate you now. I, yeah, they, 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 they despise you now. That's fair. <laughs> um, you, uh, <clears throat> you hated them and now they, they hate you. But oh, GG. Um, I don't think it's as like, much as, as everybody is going to hate this picture that's down there. Well, we'll uh, we'll see. Uh, pure unadulterated rage says Deceiver. Consistently, I've like missed a sub, and then they've still been in chat. So I've I've still been able to acknowledge them while they're here. I haven't yet had the moment I don't think when I missed someone and they weren't still in chat. So <laughs> I'm. <laughs> Oh, that so, that day is going to feel so bad. What 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 was the brain? Um, what was the brain? Right, the, so, the, um, the evolution the, of the brain. Brains. So the reason that people evolved, like, are humans evolved, like larger, large. Okay, brains are very calorie hungry. Mm -hmm. a, a more complicated, a larger brain, a brain uh, that is like a more intelligent brain requires more calories, and that means that if you do become more intelligent, like evolution demands you you must justify that extra caloric demand so it, it can happen both ways actually and it has um where creatures become more or less intelligent because it, it changes their fitness right it's a kind of a d uh well i mean the de evolution so, or, or de intellectualization or something like you're right just brain in, in order to it be in order to be economical in other places yeah yeah um the the idea here is that like their brains weren't actually helping their survivability it, it, it was just consuming calories so that they could be depressed like right. <laughs> liter literally yeah, like yeah. a bunch of calories were just going toward depression <laughs> yeah right 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 so so um mood okay yeah uh, big, big fucking mood oh i need to do the the pp check hold on oh yeah, there's a, oh, oh there's yeah. a penis oh, yeah. there's a fat oh, yeah. fucking there's there's, oh, there's a there's fat two. fucking ball. There's fat I, fucking it's balls. It's a really good thing that I stopped. They're uh, fat. Okay, there there are fat fucking balls and a and a penis. So what Here if you we were? To, can uh, you censor it with something? Maybe move Lauren on top of it. Oh, whoops. Uh, that yeah. Just just put just Lauren. put Lauren. Just put Lauren on top. Uh no, I'm going. I I have a specific uh censor. 
Copy. Also, I love the knee thumbs. Here we go. Let me. Are they plebs? Um, I'm. I'm gonna say this is not a pleb. I don't think it's a pleb. Well, chat won't be able to say yes or no because <laughs> this is just censored. fucking me. This is this is just me, dude. Me IRL. There we go. <laughs> oh my god. The 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 testicles are significant. Like that. There's those are so, those are some hangers. Yeah, that's like dong f or, or fucking testicle physics to make the the uh, Red Dead Redemption two devs jealous. Mm -hmm. Like those are dr two balls, like horse balls. <laughs> significant yeah, testicle meat. Yeah. So I think that this might actually be the um, the first on the list to uh, pass the Harkness test. That's true. Yeah. 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 Right. Because it's just like, saying it's sentient. Yeah. So, I mean, th this is the first one that I feel like can properly be rated because the other ones don't pass the Harkness test. This one does. Yeah, um, but that's well, not you fun, know, so. in the first... If you are taking one of these for the first hundred thousand years, uh, right? Because then they, you know, they they went all like idiocracy afterwards, right? Um, right. Which to bring that up again, because great, no, great. I I totally want to talk about that movie. The movie totally is relevant. The, the movie is relevant. No, it's, oh, I, no. I, I mean, kind of. The whole movie is like weird and fucked. Do you not like that movie? It's. Yeah. I don't want to talk about it on stream, okay? Really? Why? I get Mike, I swear to God. Something about this movie pisses you off, obviously. Is There's it some good lines from it? Is it too doomy? Is that why? I did Mike, Mike, I'm not I'm not gonna It's too political? It's it's, it's a, a little eugenicy. Yeah, as Champy Vanal, and that that's why I don't want to go into it too much. This is already how, like how? On okay, the all right, all right, all right. For Literally, okay, how are you fucking kidding me? Are we going to are we going to have this conversation on my stream about how Idiocracy is a, a movie about eugenics? Uh, can I can I just like can I just because I I'm, am I missing something, dude? Have you seen Idiocracy? I mean, it's been years. You're forgetting some shit, dude. Like, it is literally one of the only, like, it is one of the only interpretations of the movie. Okay. Like, it's not, if I, it's, it's, not, it's not even subtle, dude. If I think about the beginning of the movie, and I think about the, basically the, the intro of the movie. Yeah. Uh, okay. The intro of the movie. I, okay, and the rest I could of see it is now. based yeah, I could, on I could it. See, I could see that now. I could it's see that now. It is literally mm -hmm. the foundation of the movie, dude. But did the movie mean to be a movie about eugenics or did it just mean to be like, or is that kind of like not the point? Or, I, I know, think I, it was Mike Judge just being annoyed at, at like human. I think it was a, I think that Mike Judge had a very long Reddit moment. That's what, <laughs> that's what it is. Yeah. Idiocracy uh, is, is Mike Judge's Reddit moment. It hinges on the idea that intellect is is genetic, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. I, I, okay, okay. No, I, I wasn't it's, thinking about it. That I'm not way, even but, going but, to start yeah. getting into that. I wasn't thinking. Like, literally, I wasn't this thinking is why I didn't want to fucking talk the, about the, it. But, but you know, um, what, whatever. I mean, like, dude, it's not the it's not the end of the world, right? Um, I just didn't. I I was like puzzled as to why you were so adamant about not because I didn't. I just didn't want because thinking I don't about want to way. have a chat on my stream about eugenics. <laughs> I wasn't even. I wasn't seeing the, the fucking connection. I am seeing the the, the connection now. <laughs> Jesus, I Christ. am seeing the connection now. Okay, we're not. We don't. We're not. We're not, we're not having a chat about eugenics. We're having a chat about how in that how that movie. We were having a chat, or we are having it, a chat. Sports about how Ghostly that movie says. It, was, I think okay. it's an important thing to talk about. I I don't want to become a politics stream. I don't um, want to become a political streamer. I'm sorry to disappoint all of the political streamers who are now subscribed to me, like Germa. Um, and <laughs> they're going to be really disappointed in you. Not going that. Not going that direction. You don't want to disappoint Hassan. Yeah, I don't even know who these people are, and I don't want to know. Like, don't don't make me tap the sign, the sign that is um you like you are Hannibal.
it is 217 BCE. I think a, th- I think the movie very clumsily, yeah, like fucking used that to like make a point, which which uh, had not occurred to me before. Honest, honestly, that had not occurred to me before. Um. Anyways, yeah, I'm sorry. I, anyways, <laughs> anyways, eugenics. Here we fucking go. Part one. We're doing the next one. <laughs> Um, All right, let me let me um, uncensor this and move on. Eugenics, God, a thread. God Wait a minute, damn go it, back, Mike. go go back up there, go back up there, go back up there. Do, oh, do, okay, where well, where let me is recensor it? Because where um, what where are you? How are you rating his fuckability? Because you didn't do that. and we we see his penis like clearly. So I mean, like that can factor in. Like if you like, you know, if you yeah. like that kind of that kind of cock and the kind those kinds of balls that could help inform your your decision. Listen, listen, the the cock, five out of 10, the balls, nine out of 10. (laughs) Yeah. They look like, fuck, it looks like somebody put billiard balls in like a tube sock. Right. Like it's very (laughs) disgusting. You know how some people, you know how some people say like that, like people tell you to gargle balls. You literally could with this though. Yeah, you actually could do it. You literally could. Um, but like, like fucking drench, drench those balls in like Listerine and then go to town. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, what do you think about, all right, so let, let's, I mean, I'm going to give them like a, like a, like a fucking, like a two or a three on the, on the, um, you know, on the, on the smashometer. But what about like riding him? Not his cock. Just like slapping a saddle on the, on the back and, and just, you know. Maybe we could we could race these fucking things. Could be fun. <laughs> race the depressed mantelopes. Yeah, yeah, and and I mean like okay, they they get a little bit sad. Whatever, you give them a carrot or some shit, and it's like no, I'm a human. It's like shut up, shut up and run. Go faster. <laughs> um, that's fucking terrible. Uh, I like his, his neck. Um, nice long neck could probably accommodate a lot of liquid um well, i hate the penis so knees the, the penis knees those are his thumbs they are yeah, yeah you're right those are his thumbs uh, it's i a didn't giraffe. realize that it's a giraffe but it's a man the preview so, panel cox they're yeah, they can't they can't see you get out of here don't worry don't worry he's a jill ref because he's a human <clears throat> see i thought you were making like a joe rogan joke it's that like that too i mean <laughs> Rogan is barely, he's barely human, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, the, 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 the apification. Th- this is like, I mean, so, and I, I hate to say this. I feel like I say this about everything, but I think with All Tomorrows, it's kind of unavoidable. Um, I mean, it totally is avoidable, but I'm not going to avoid it for the content. But like, people have been masturbating to this book. You think so? In, in an experimental way? I'm sorry to report that to you, but like, what are the odds? Like, c- come on. Like, you think they have it? I mean, they've tried. I I don't know. It, it would be like a challenge fap. Not my proudest fap. Um, I, I think <laughs> this, no, is, no, this is going to be a hard no, fap. This is going to be a no, hard no, no, fap. No, 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 no. Like, I, th- when you say not, I'm, I'm actually, I'm going to contradict you here. Uh-huh, uh-huh. If if you say not my proudest fap, it's something that you find like attractive, mm, that's but are ashamed of true, finding true, true. attractive. This conversely I, like, is I if yeah. I could manage to nut while looking at this, You'd I'd be, be proud of you that. You would be proud of that, like, right? I that's accomplished the, a struggle. It's like this is gonna be a really uh a really difficult thing to fap to, but you did right, it anyway, it, and that's a badge of honor. Right. You have to like it, it would take practice. You have, you have to like meditate to make the proper pathways in your brain. Like, it's like many, yeah. this is it, it, this is one of those like it, it's not about the it, the sacrifices that you'd have <laughs> to make. It, it's like climbing a sexual mountain. Uh, right? You need to prepare yeah. yourself. You need to be properly armed. You like may, maybe you even find that you have to switch different kinds of lube part way through <laughs> your experimentation. So you have to have all like everything laid out and prepared like th- this is your everest you sit down and you're not leaving <laughs> for days 
Oh man, there are people in chat. This is gonna fuck you up, but there are people in chat right now that are climbing that Everest as we speak. Oh yeah, people. <laughs> there's a, <laughs> there's the, oh book. there's a video on YouTube. Uh, that Sir Capslock found. It's called "Ranking All Tomorrow Species by Sex Appeal." Oh, uh, we are like late to the party here, dude. Oh yeah, completely. Fuck. So I mean, like. <laughs> We're very late to this party. Okay, so let me see another freak. Okay, uh, we are going overtime, so we'll do we'll do one more freak. All right, one more freak, yeah, and then one we'll more call freak. it. Sure. Okay. Sure. Uh, well, hold on. I have. And I, I love the idea that we could come back to this because I don't. Know, I've really enjoyed this person. Oh yeah, we're like a quarter of the way through this. Um, I, and we'll we'll do it on your stream for sure. Well, we could, well, well. Do you think we're gonna finish it then on my stream? Either no, we're gonna do the same oh, fucking okay. thing, and then and then and then we'll go back, and then we'll come back to this channel, and we'll we'll go back and forth. It'll be like you know, again, like I said, joint custody on like alternating weekends or whatever. Yeah. You know, <laughs> it'll just we'll we'll take turns with it if you want. All right, sounds good. Um, swimmers. Perhaps because <laughs> Fred, their Fred, I'm, I'm, yes. I'm sorry, but I, you need to know that the video we were just talking about has one million views. Oh, good. According to chat. <laughs> oh, <good. laughs> not only is it, uh, not only was our idea unoriginal, but it's also played out. <laughs> yeah. Yay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Perhaps because their na natural life cycle involved an aquatic larval stage, the coup had transmuted a large number of their human subjects into a bewildering array of aquatic creatures. Taken care of by specially bred attendants, these post-human water babies came in every shape and size imaginable. There were limbless, ribbon-like varieties of eel people, huge mm. whale-like behemoths, oh, yeah. decorative people who swam by squirting water out of their hyper hypertrophied mouths, and horrifying mm. multitudes of brainless wallowers that served as food stock. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Honestly, goals. All of them were perfect. <laughs> All of them were perfectly domesticated. All of them went extinct when their masters left, all save a few lightly mutated, generalized forms. These swimmers still resembled their human ancestors to a large degree. They had no artificial gills, their hands were still visible through their front flippers, their feet were splayed affairs that functioned like a pair of tail flukes. Recognizably human eyes peeked through their blubbery eyelids, and they spoke to each other, though not in words, and never in sentient understanding. Little fella lord? So, Chat? Th no, no, this is just your your genetic future, Mike, just swimming around in the ocean by, by squirting water out of your mouth and popping up above the surface just to say, come, 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 come. It's, it's like come. a, yeah, it's, 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 a, it's a fucking, uh, like, it's just, it's like echolocation. At come yeah. location, if you will. Yeah. Um, no, no, see that? <laughs> this would just be an instinct left over. Uh, it's not even, right, it, it serves no purpose. It's just a, a fucking vestigial right. vocalization. Yeah. Um, <laughs> see, like, I like the, one of the words, the, one of the, the actual specific words used is brainless. And I mean, like, I'm already there. So we don't have to wait. The future is now. Guys, it's it's okay. I'm there too. I'm just like me. Find funny internet thing. Hey everyone, look at funny internet thing. <laughs> yeah, but you use big words when you do it. <laughs> I just say the same three big words over and over again. I can't live like this anymore. Was little fella really Mike from the future? Um, that well, maybe yeah. I mean, I'm seeing some some overlap with with that creature, right? Um. But you're, you know, you're, you're gonna, you're, you're putting out this, uh, this fucking Eve online video pretty, what, in, a, in about a month? Am I right? Uh, no, it's, it'll be a, a few months more. Oh, okay. Sorry. Um, but, uh, I mean, that, that's not, you know, that's not brainless. That's, that's fucking, I mean, I, I guess. can't wait to see it. Um, I mean, it, ask the average Eve player. <laughs> mm. Uh, well, you've been playing the game yourself. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Um, is it, are you enjoying it or is it just, oh, yeah. you see it no, as like I, I plan on, I, I haven't had a lot of time to play it, um, mm. for the last, like, like I, around, since around the end of, uh, last year, mm -hmm. but I intend to keep playing it. Okay. Yeah. Is this something you think I could enjoy? Maybe. 
I, I mean, I could show you. I could show you the ropes. Yeah, it could be fun. Yeah. Um, that that'd be interesting to see you try out Eve. Uh, also, well, I I don't think I would get too sucked into a game like that. You gotta you, you gotta play with other people. That's the big thing. Yeah. Right. It like it it's Eve isn't great alone. You gotta do things with other people. That's where the real fun comes in. With most games like that, right? You gotta be. So it's a social experience. Yeah, it, it's a very social thing. I did see the pizza video. Th eighty eight. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, people were absolutely just going crazy. Like Mike has to see this. <laughs> I was like, chat was going to rip my throat out if I didn't show it to you. Uh, oh, I did. I did see it. So please leave his thrusty intact. <laughs> For millennia, they swam the oceans of their ecologically stunted world, feeding on diversifying kinds of fish and crustaceans. Survivors of the food stock originally imported from Earth. With the intervention of the coup gone, natural selection resumed. The swimmers became more streamlined to better catch their fast prey. The prey responded by getting even faster or evolving defensive countermeasures such as armor, spikes, or poison. Their evolution, I mean, isn't this just the evolution of VTubers? Their evolution <laughs> back on track. This is what we're going to see. We're going to see like some VTubers just evolve new traits like, squirting ink onto the fucking yeah like, it's like oh god political streamer raid ink the screen <laughs> <laughs> all right yeah uh, someone says vouch and they just run <laughs> i like to call, i like to call that guy douche i look i i, just, I at this, I, I don't know. I don't know any of these Me people's neither. deal. I don't know, any, dude. I don't know anything about that guy except except apparently he's got you know like he's got some shitty opinions about things. I, do, and, I and, don't. I don't know, and I don't want to know. And his I name. Don't want his, to know. his name sounds like douche, so I call him douche. It's very simple. <laughs> I don't have to know anymore. He's a big. He's a political streamer. You're gonna tell me he's not I, a douche. I, I can't. I can't even tell you whether you're right or wrong because i don't know all i know is that there are beefs of one kind or another they're fucking political I I, I, you, how can you be a political youtuber or whatever and not be a douche yeah oh. it's kind of it's part and parcel it's a, it's a creator uh whatever, whatever all right so i fucking their evolution back on track, the swimmers drifted further and further away from their sentient ancestry. They would wait for a long time indeed to taste that Blissey again. Uh, you understand that Blissey is a Pokemon, right? Blissey. Yeah, Blissey. Blessusy. Bl you, what, what you're adding, you don't need to add extra syllables to this. Blessusy. Bliss, 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 did did I just hear saucy? Oh no, Mike's Chat. turning into just an RPG. Chat. 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 Yeah, here they come. <laughs> do, 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 do. They're so they're so good. <laughs> they're so good. I love the app like the, the owl owlification of him. Yeah, isn't it so good? Yeah. I, I saw that and I wasn't sure at first, but no, it's good. Well, uh let me do a penis inspection real quick. Mm -hmm. Uh no pee pee. <laughs> wow. That is good. <laughs> All right, so that is good. Can chat see him yet? Yes, chat can see him now. All right, couple of things I noticed right off the bat. Mm -hmm. right. Um, this thing exists, right? Like this is just a goblin shark. Like that's what they look <laughs> like. I'm not kidding. Like Google goblin shark. Google goblin shark right now. Like just Google I know, I know, search. I know, dude. I, oh, I, I, just, I, in case chat hasn't seen hasn't seen it. I originally went to college with the intention of becoming a marine biologist. Oh, did you? Yeah. Um, so, I mean, like, it's got a human nose, but, like, the goblin shark has a human nose. Right? Kind of does. Like, no, it's it's more like a flat. Okay, it's no, like I see human, it. it okay, I'm, like, I'm, like visualizing nose. it. Yeah, no, I can see it. Um, 
All right, so he's got the front flippers. He's got a marine like, the, so biologist. What's funny Ooh-rah. is that both <laughs> of his legs turned into like flukes. So he's got these double flukes. Wouldn't that suck though, for in terms of like mobility? Mike, like, wouldn't you know that sea lions exist, right? They don't have they don't. Okay, but do sea lions have two tails that end in two flukes? Yes. So they, they have a total of four flukes. They, no, they 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 have they have the two fins. You look at look at this guy again, and look at the fact that he has two two separate fucking entire things, like entire fuck. So he's got four dealios back there, right? Sort of. It's just two flukes. That is kind of sim. That's more similar to what sea lions have going on. Yeah, that is yeah. More similar, but a sea lion is simply just like a like a like a fucking like halfway evolved dolphin, basically. Kind of, yeah. That's all the fucking is. No, knowing yeah. that, I don't want to know your opinion on this thing's fuckability. Um, Do you know how many people, like, th- there was a whole website called, like, what, like, Dolphin Love or something that was specifically mm, about how to fuck dolphins? Mm, all right. So, this thing, I like its goofy smile. Like, his, his he's like, hey. You know? Like, oh, he's, yeah, he looks stone jelly. That that was a whole thing, right? Like oh, the, the stuff that made that made animals orgasm so hard that they died. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> oh, Mike. Mute. Okay, someone in chat said, "Listen to this." Some Muta- people know. Yep, mutated. Some people in chat. <laughs> There's the tea. I will leave. <laughs> Listen. Mutated mobility. Mary screaming. Well, this is great. Out of her dolphin blowhole. <laughs> well, well, this is wonderful. I'm a dolphin. <laughs> well, this is just great. Excuse me. You almost hit me with your boat propeller. I hate <laughs> boat propellers. They scratch me and cut me. I- <laughs> I'm I'm covered in scars from boat propellers. <laughs> oh my god. It's like a manatee, but it's like a Mary oh. tea. Mobility Mary tea. Oh. Well, this oh. is fucking cool. Mobility I recently, manatee. <laughs> I, I recently rewatched the video of her trying to back up from underneath <laughs> like underneath that overpass again. And like I get it. It's a frustrating and kind of scary situation. Sure. But the whimpering is... Over the top. It it, it elicited some sort of primal anger instinct. I I cannot explain it. I I think... You know what I think it is? I think it's performative. No, I was just going to say that. The the reason it's pissing you off is because the whimpering is for the benefit of that camera. Like, do you think if that camera wasn't on, she'd be whimpering like that? No. No. Yeah, do you think that... what sidling up to someone and giving them like what four dollars and 19 cents in like can return receipts <laughs> the fuck was that to, to a homeless person it was her being like like she she walked like okay walked she she rolled up to someone like to, to the homeless person we covered it on the warrens and like yeah. it was just a homeless person she's like do you want this receipt i returned some bottles and cans and it's it's four dollars and 19 cents or something like that and the woman was like no <laughs> <laughs> no and then as she's like reversing away from these per this person she's like thought you'd want the money Right, the like, thought you'd uh, want the money, which was like, wow, kind of shitty. It's like, are you kidding me? She's not kidding you. Um, I, rest in I, peace. I'm sorry, though. even just talking about piss, her. I, I know, like, we'll piss you off a little bit. <laughs> it's Well, I mean, like, it, it was all performative. And, and that's exactly what this creature is. It, it's performative and... Shallow and pedantic. I mean... <laughs> Do you think that the legs move up and down like the way like, you know, are do you think that the the joints, the hip joints operate like ours? Or do you think they operate from like left to right, like side to side? Like what do you, like how do you think they operate? Um well the flippers are probably on a ball joint because that's how our shoulders are. 
Oh, you, oh, really? Oh, you think it's like, oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Okay, but not the, the hip joint, but the flipper joint. Like the knee, the knee basically, the knee would be on a, on a ball joint. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's kind of hot. Uh, um, like the knee, the, like the, um, the, the flippers, the, the rear. Yeah, I think, I think that it's a, a, a ball joint. Um, Tradon says that we never showed any videos of her with the bird that we did talk about them. We debate, we, 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 we debated it. Um, I think yeah. the re- the reason we didn't use the videos with the bird is because there was like nothing it was like, you know, it was nothing funny. Wasn't it wasn't yeah. anything funny in them. Like, you know, it wasn't anything like <laughs> remarkable or like noteworthy or, or, or whatever, though it was, you know, it would have, it would have been, maybe it would have been equitable to show her, her more tender side in that, in, 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 by, by showing one of those videos, you know? Because they really did, they really did humanize her to show her like with her her pet, you know. Yeah, but uh-huh. I also remember some people saying like she absolutely was not taking care of that bird the way right. it needed to be taken care of, and Just that because birds yeah. have a lot of like needs. Yeah, it probably would have been a little bit um, distracting to get into to get into like you know this 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 potential like maybe animal abuse or animal neglect angle of this fucking woman, you know. But, I guess, um, like, we, we, I think it's reasonable to show just one kind of content from someone, too. Mm-hmm. Like, if someone just, like, dissected, She wasn't known for her bird videos. Right. She right, was known right. for her yeah. traffic violation videos. Sh- shenanigans, yeah. Um. So, anyway, I give this thing a f- maybe, like, a 5 out of 10 on the, God damn uh, it. On the Smashometer. Um, My, Mike is sliding into that dull fussy. This is like uh, the fucking what? What was his name? What, 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 was it Jake Gyllenhaal? I think in Tusk. You ever see that movie? The guy gets it's like I never it's like watched it. No, it's like Human Centipede, but like the doctor like turns the guy into a walrus. It's really fucking bad. Don't I, watch I it. remember it was. Um, Don't even bother. Don't even waste. What your was it? Time. Uh, it? It was. Uh, who who's the director? I'm trying to remember. He's like it's uh, Kevin. He's one of those Kevin people Smith. that's Kevin like, Smith. huh? Kevin Smith. Kevin Smith. Yeah. yeah. He, I, I was going to say one of those people who's way too plugged into nerd culture. Yeah, for sure. Like th- what he cried when he saw the Millennium Falcon. <laughs> yeah, he's in the new mood. <laughs> yeah, he, he's 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 got to calm down a little bit. He he is like you you know you know that uh, red letter media video that was. Um, I clapped. I clapped when I yeah. saw Darth Vader. That's, that's him on ironically. Yeah, that's Star him on Star Destroyers. Yeah. I'm gonna come. That, yeah. That's literally Kevin Smith. Yeah. <laughs> and what? and fucking um uh, uh uh the dude who played Wesley Crusher. Um that dude yeah, I can't remember. They're, they're all part. They're all part of like this weird nerd. Will Wheaton. Will Wheaton. Yeah, um, they're all part of this weird nerd ecosystem that is just self congratulatory and masturbatory. <laughs> yeah. That I, I find repulsive. it can go. It, it, yeah, it can go fuck itself. I agree with this wholeheartedly. Whatever that uh, is, yeah. is, is, is is like cringy. I don't like. It. I, I I find I find it repulsive personally. Who else is in that? Like what like, in in that circle? Yeah, in that ecosystem. Uh, Kev- Kevin Smith, Will Wheaton, um, masturbatory. He's so th- right. There, I, mean. th- th- <laughs> I there's an argument to be made for um the uh who are they the the tabletop group um critical role, but th- I, I feel I feel I feel like they're not as bad. I think that's a different right? thing. Like yeah. all of them are like active professionals working in different sorts of media Mm -hmm. and they are uh, actually also making something rather than just talking about nerd culture yeah um i i like they don't get they don't give me the same vibe like i i actually when i see them and doing stuff i have i have a more i have a positive reaction to them i i like i what i have seen of them i rather like of them um so i don't think they quite fall into that realm joss whedon i think joss whedon is definitely in there yeah, but jo- uh, what he, d- does he celebrate nerd yeah. culture? Ab- yeah. Like, is he? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. I I don't know. Yeah. Um, Lamango said this is a street shark. You think he's around mound the pound? Well, he's not brolic, so like he's not like he's not like jacked, dude. So I don't think he's a street shark. Right. 
Lazare, thank you very much for the sub. And hey, congratulations on your induction into the bonus bean room. You've been beaned. Be bean. Hey, um, <laughs> have you considered saying something like Bienvenido a la familia? No. Well, you should. No. Starting right now. Say it. No. Say it. Say it. No. Say it. No. Say it. No. Say it. No. You gotta say it. Say it. Come on, say it. No. You gotta say no. it. Say it. No. Say, say no. bienvenido. Go ahead. Say it. No. Bienvenido. No. 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 It's gonna feel no. good once you say it, I promise. No. No. All right. Look at the next. Mike, fucking... don't you start telling me what's going to feel good. You want to fuck a man dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> well, not really. All right, what do you mean not? Well, what is a five out of ten? Yeah, I'm memeing. I don't know. Fucking scroll, <laughs> scroll down. Ah, uh, the meme defense. The yeah. last defense of the horny. All right, all right. Come on. Let me let me see another freak. Unless you well, you wanted to end. You said. Yeah, we're we're at the th like we are overtime. Actually, it's, it's we're at all three right. hours and twenty minutes. So. What do you want to do? Um, well, now I, I figure now would be a good time. Um, if you'd like, we well, because uh, some of the art might um, actually have have you in it. In fact, I'm pretty sure that there is some um, we got to sure. Let's go take through a, art and then call it. Sure. Let's take a look at some uh, some of that art. Dude. All right. Yeah, I have to scroll up because I scrolled down. Here we go. Wait. Uh no that there we go da ba da ba da 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 God damn it right oh, Shala deep faked me into I don't know what this is I <laughs> yeah. I actually do not know what this is Somebody please tell me Yeah but I'm I don't scared. even like how are you deep faked into that I don't even see you in there. Yeah, it took me a minute to figure out how I was even. What is that your face? Is that your it. face? That's like, my that face. That's my face in there. Okay, but that doesn't look like you at all. Um, it do it doesn't. It took me a long time I mean, to figure out that's what it was supposed to be. Um, crazy hamburger. I don't even know what's supposed to be happening here. There's a lot going on. <laughs> Apparently, um, crazy hamburger stands with Ukraine too. It's a it's a fucking smoldering <laughs> hamburger with green fucking smoke coming out of it. Is it? Yeah, it is coming out of the burger. Goddamn! <laughs> How is it? It's like a smoke bomb in the burger. I guess there's a lot. Again, there's a lot going on, and I can't parse any of it. Thank you, Shala, for the the Saturday confusion. Um. What is Oh, oh, oh shit! Oh, it was that. That's just what it was. Um, it was a reply to the. Oh, here we go. Oh fuck! We have you guys, incoming froggy. Prepare yourselves. That is horrifying. What the fuck, froggy? Yeah. Moments after finding out someone doesn't know froggy song. <laughs> Me after discovering. I think I need more cursed and meaty art ideas. Don't worry. Just hang around on this stream. You'll Fred, read plenty. God, that is... You became extremely uh, robotic. Your your audio quality, like, nosedived, and you're like a robot. I don't know why. Oh, really? On, on oh, yours? On, on, on Discord. Maybe chat's not hearing it? Um, I don't think chat's hearing it. No, I think I think it's a Discord thing. Frank, when he sees an unsucked cock... I... It's oh, a, it's what gave it away the T. It, it's it's a fucking all tomorrow's bird birdman. That, that's what birdman. I thought it was yeah, originally yeah, yeah. when I saw it, and then I read it. It's like oh, it's froggy. It's like all tomorrow's froggy. <laughs> Fred when he sees an unsucked cock. <laughs> God damn it. Um. Yeah, it's 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 beautiful. Generic um, ghosts. This is uh, Evan. Oh, it's Evan Thorns. Yeah, duh. Uh, thank you. I think. You you know when you get fan art and you're not sure it whether to thank the person or to they you know tell them fuck you yeah I know yeah I, well I, no, this is so good though it's so well done 
Thank you for the existential crisis. Um, Fred, somebody <laughs> yeah. somebody asked if I'm going to stream later. You mind if I answer that? Yeah, go for it. Uh, I don't know uh, what I I, th I think so. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. The answer is yes. Yeah, but everyone, I don't know what um, I'm gonna what I'm gonna do yet. Everyone um, who's come in and doesn't know Mike, uh, go and follow him. Uh, he's just jabroni underscore. Are you know what? I can I can just straight link to you. You're a you're a swell <clears throat> a swell fella. Thank you you're, for doing that, bud. Go go if you enjoyed if you enjoyed funny come man. Uh, go it. <laughs> There's, there's, I have content that's not related to semen, I swear. I swear to God, I do. Mm -hmm. Just, you know, sometimes. If yeah, if, so, like, you're the cum guy, I'm the feet guy, we get together, and it's magic. Um, It's gooey, gooey magic. I'm not gonna you. say that ever again. No, God. please, please continue no, saying that. No, that's, I, no, no. Uh, but thank you for, um showing me buddy i'm not yeah um what of the course. what the fuck did i i want i saw something in chat and now I, I i can't it was something relevant oh kirby I, it might be kirby it might be isaac i think it's gonna be kirby i think i'm gonna finish up um i think i'm gonna like finish the game tonight so that's what i'll okay. be doing and nice. probably in like a few hours i think kirby and the four gore put kirby in the in the four gore yeah it's very fun I mean, it's, you know, it's, it's like easy, but. Oh my God. So first time chat from Theo Czar. If you're the cum guy, I'm <laughs> the, the feet guy. Duo. My girlfriend told me to follow. All right. So you're, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> so, to, to be fair, I feel like I become ever more cursed with Mike around. He's not like this normally. I think, yeah, I bring it out. I bring it out in him a little bit. Yeah. I bring out the doom in him, and I bring out like the like like the cockification of him yeah. and, and like semenification of him a little bit. Hey, Illyrius, how are you doing? Um, I I've mentioned them before, but Illyrius, I, I used to play competitive Guns of Icarus with them. Oh man, yeah, um, Illyri uh, no, Illyrius is is a good, good. Good gamer. Thank you so much for the five gift subs. And hey, to all of you who nabbed one of those. Yeah, Rip Goyo. I used to be a caster for that game. Jesse, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> it, it's a... Um, it's an 8... Well, I mean, competitively, it was an 8v8 um, game where you had uh, four people each on a ship oh thanks for the bean mike <laughs> of course um ba basically you had two ships uh two airships and then each airship had four people on it running around on its on its decks and um repairing stuff and firing guns and uh, oh a little a little bit like um that game we played barrow trauma yeah it, it feels a little bit similar or or, or, or the um, one that i, I that I was gonna play with you guys that day, um, the st uh, the one with the space space yeah, ship. Um, 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 uh, yeah, the, the the pulsar lost colony. Yeah, pulsar. Yeah, pulsar. Yeah. Hey, um, Illyrius also has been subbed for four months now. Just so themselves, hmm. thank you so much, and you as well must be inducted. The diuretic duo, uh, come mistress yeah. J Chan and come doctor. Uh, Lori saying, dude, why are your fucking tits so big? <laughs> they're perky. <laughs> they're not perky. They're they're fucking just monstrous. What the fuck? <laughs> All the better to drown you in, my dear. Th those are those are gonna be like like water balloons. Like what the fuck? All right, dude. <laughs> um, she's great. Big humdonga humdongaroos. Humdongbagdongo. <laughs> thank you thank you very much Shala I, <laughs> for the diuretic duo we're we're here to make pizza mike if if we ever stream together in real life we got it we gotta make a pizza just as uh we gotta make all the different pizzas because k has made many different pizzas fred i want that to happen so bad i i i fucking so fred messaged me on discord a little while ago and he and he said, um, he said, I want to, I want to eat the jabrusi. I don't oh, know why yeah. he said that, but I, but I fucking dude. All I did was I went to Google and I and I typed up like flights to New York, 
You and I, I just sent him like a list of flights to New York, like you know, for like under un, under like one hundred and fifty dollars. And and then like and then like a day later, he didn't answer, and I was like, my asshole remains uneaten. How long will you let <laughs> this continue? This is this is our friendship. Yeah. This is what you need to know. And I'm, I'm my asshole remains uneaten, <laughs> like to this day. You you mean your jabrusi? My jabrusi remains uneaten. He's <laughs> he's re, he's letting it continue. He's letting it. He's letting that happen, Chat. I'm 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 letting it ripen. <laughs> I'm sorry. He wants it to get to age maturely, but he doesn't. He, he what he doesn't realize is I will never age maturely. <laughs> uh, he's waiting. It's a lost cause to wait for that. Okay, I need to fucking. I swear to God, this isn't how stream usually is. <laughs> no, I think Fred prides himself on having a stream that has like, you know, a, a lack of of this type of shit. Yeah, and then and then I bring you on. Well, I'm gonna be. I listen. I in the beginning of the stream, I was trying to avoid being like this. Uh -huh. But then, but then, chat was just like, "Come cock, come, come chat cock." Knew. Chat knew, and I, they, I was, I was like, "All right, well, I, I was like, okay, well, I have to, I have to fucking like give them what they want, you know." I... No, you don't. You don't. You, give you, you they, get to make the, you get to make the stream that you want. Um, it's your stream. They will riot. They will. They will. They will actually riot. Um, <laughs> Where's the cum? What? Say the line, Mike. Bart. Yeah, say the line, Bart. This is gorgeous. Um, yeah, I can already see it's GG. This is awesome, this, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is absolutely GG. Beautiful. Yeah, this is GG Marvels. Yeah. Really cool. Immediately recognizable, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very distinct Always. art style. Yeah. Mm hmm. And they say Love some it. Lauren and Jabroni Mike art for the stream today. Nice seeing them get together. We'll probably post this on Mike's Boru. Cool. Yeah. I. All yeah, right. your viewers, your viewers ought to see it too. This is absolutely adorable. I love, I love the way that you draw Lauren all, all poofy. The mask boy uh, also just looks adorable so, every time. Every oh time yeah. You draw him. Oh yeah. This is this is precious. I will like. I want to scoop them into my palms. Oh, uh, scoop them up. All right. So, um, what else you got? Because I have to pee a little bit. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Um I've been hydrating and th this is why I don't drink during streams because if I drink during streams I have to piss constantly. You know? Like I I, I got gotcha. you. Oh, we have to hydrate, you know? We have a um mini di all of the different Laurens, all of the different Laurens. We have we have Sturbears, Shalas, Mintelects, uh oh, and we we have some from uh Frank from the the other Frank to be frank it's like the other meat except the other frank we have mint yeah we have another mintelect we have ika pika's um harpy chan right at the center yeah we have there are so many lori chans it's like anything anything but lauren <laughs> no I, i'm just teasing uh and i like the There's fucking the big the big tit like demon one back there yeah, she's uh, the Sarkic uh, god. Mm -hmm. uh, well, not the god. Uh, she's a uh, Clavagar, I believe they were called. Like right underneath um, the um, the Grand Carcass Ion. Mm -hmm. Or Eon. There's a lot going on there. Yeah. We, we realized that the description almost identically matched Harpy Lauren. She's a real estate agent now. Yeah, congratulations. Dude, may she succeed where I failed because when I had a real estate yeah. license, it was one of the biggest wastes of time in my life. And let me tell you, that's saying a lot. That's saying a lot. Uh, Sorry I'm for the just getting some just getting in some last second doom, my bad. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ika Pika is has gone even harder. We have the fat nutters. It's it's pelvic <laughs> oh bone. Oh my god. I don't know if we can leave that on stream, but <gasps> oh, the it's fat pel nutter. the pelvic bones. <laughs> I don't think I can leave that on stream, but uh thank you Ika Pika, I think. <laughs> uh we also have the cum oh sugar. My god. <laughs> it's, it's great. Entire species engineered to chug cum. 
you know, just in case. <laughs> oh, dude, that's great. Oh, I, I like his gunt and everything. Really oh, nice. Oh, yeah, it's good. Like it, he's it's got... based on this. Right, 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 right. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, his yeah. jaw on hinges so he can like more effectively chug cum. Yeah, right. designed by the coup for their cum chugging needs. We also have um, a, a video. There are... Inside you, there are two wolves. Come, you know, come, hey, come. Remember, come, 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 come. Remember, come, 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 come. Okay, why am I? Why am I only hearing audio? Why can't I see this video? Are you watching it? Yeah, I'm watching it. I'm not seeing it. I'm seeing. I'm still looking at the cum chugging art. I'm hearing audio. My God! God damn it! Hold on. Listen. Come. I think uh, that was part of the word become. I, I think that the audio was enough. I don't, I, I get I get the just yeah, the jizz. I get the jizz of it. Uh, you just you see the, the audio. Jizz okay, the jizz. good. I got the jizz of it. Uh, and we have, of course, canonically bigger than an oil tanker boob. Why am what? I not? I'm not seeing any of it. You're not screen sharing it with me. Am or I something? Not? Something weird is happening. I'm still okay, looking here, at the cum, me, the cum me, chugger. Let me try again. Fucking all tomorrow's guy. Let me let me choose the screen again. Here we go. Is that working? No, not no. no okay, no. yeah. Let me try again. Sorry, Mike. Bonk. <laughs> there we go. Okay, canonically bigger than oil tanker. Oh, because yeah. like fat tits instead of fat nuts, right? Instead right, of right, fat right, nuts, right. yeah. Dude, those are awesome. I like how you could like shelter from rain underneath them. Oh yeah, no, they inviting. In, you could, yeah, you, you, they're inviting uh, on both a booba way and a if if we were out in the woods, I could use her breasts rather than a lean to. Exactly, yeah. I mean, I don't know. Look at those fucking things. Like, I feel like a meteorite would bounce off of them. Right. Like, just you could you could hide under them from anything. Is what I'm saying. <laughs> Structural cleavage. <laughs> Thank you, Ika Pika. I need to. There we go. The the fat nuts are concerning. I I I think we're okay. But uh, who baby? She's got meteor. Meteor protection. And look at this intellect. Also, always Ooh. very recognizable. Right. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. Why he purple? <laughs> purple lord. Oh, this this is so cute. Look at this. I love I love all the different Lori Chans. Oh, this looks I, so I, cute. I love, that, no, like there's like, the Lori you. Chan hanging out with your Brony Chan. This is this is so cute. I love the outfit. The outfit is quality. And they they like swapped and gave Lauren a like like Jabroni Chan palette. Looks like yeah. yeah. That's that that's really that's really pretty. I I don't know. I just like purple. Oh, that th this is probably my favorite bit of the whole thing though. That's cute. That is, that is absolutely precious. They're, it's they're like, fucking. They're, hey, they're Mike, fucking. you're ready for body horror? And you're like, <laughs> yeah, Fred, okay. <laughs> um, Jabroni Mike killed five children at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Because <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm an animatronic. Um, yes. I'm holding in so much piss, but I don't want to miss the art. Is there more art? Okay. Uh, yes, there is. There, there's probably a lot more, actually. You read oh, all tomorrows go. because you want to posit the future of humanity. I read all tomorrows to wank. We are not the same. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank you, Farah. This is yeah. quality. The okay, I'd like to point out, Theo Sar said, uh, my girlfriend told me to follow, and I yeah. came in on talking about come." And now they like they, they said my girlfriend also told me to follow Mike, and after like the the thirty minute trial period, you know what Theo Sar has done? What's that? Theo Zar has joined the bonus bean room. Congratulations on your decisions. <laughs> May they prove fruitful. May they prove being official to you. That was that was good. That was good. That was a plus two. 
There was nothing wrong with the other one. <laughs> Bean Venito. There was that was up. That was also that was fine. Bean Venito. <laughs> Right, I misjudged this. who was going to be order and who was going to be chaos in this stream. A small Image bit of not. metaphor. That's stupid. That's stupid. I hate it. That's fucking stupid. I stand by that. <laughs> um, it, it's not the best, but it's passable. Thank, I thank mean, you, it's, Farah. It's fucking okay. After t- it, it, it works. Barely. Oh my god! Oh, look at the fat boy. Oh, he's so oh. good. Like immediately popped it, a it, it, It's a Lauren. I didn't even realize it's Lo- it's Lauren as the Therizinosaurus. Yeah. Oh, that's so good. It is. Wow. Ashbell, this is this is fantastic. He's just he just wanna dig. He just wanna dig. Eat root. He's digging for tubers. What if, what if I just wanna eat root? I wanna boop his snoot <laughs> while he eat root. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he looks he looks like he's made for hugs. He's very like cozy and comfy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> very very comfy. Got a comfy hug. Ah, uh, werewolf were werewolfy. Holy shit. Werewolfy. Thank you so much for the sub and hey. Oh, you know what? No. I I you guys, I have something on my soundboard for this now. Is it the sound of me pissing? Because that's what I, I have to go do. No, you, you can go for a minute if you want to. Yeah, I'll be right back. Okay. Um, and we'll hang out and look at the boy. Yeah, you're my friend now. I'll, I'll play it. I'll play it one more time. <laughs> Canonically, the sound that he that big boy, big boy makes. Big Lauren. Ha. Oh. I, I don't want to keep looking at this stuff. You know what? Hold on. While while we wait for Mike to come back. What do I have? You know what? I'm I'm going to become a hack fraud and just look at my YouTube history real quick. What's here? I know there's got to be something worthwhile. Wow, there's nothing worthwhile in my watch history. Literally nothing. Well, anything to share on? Like it's, it's all just the stuff I've watched on other streams. <laughs> hey, Arc Wolf Nine has been subbed for three months now. Thank you so much. And hey, thank you so much. And it we're we're going fucking choo choo now, baby. Uh. Hold on. Hold on. I I let, let's not let's not break the magic. Let's not let's not break the magic. Uh, uh BRB screen. Uh and then I go here and then I do the I need to assign this to a button or something. A bu- button. Button. Why did I pronounce it like that? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. And I'm back. Hi, hype train again. It was so much piss. D- what do you so mean pissed. so much? God damn it! it immersion just, broken. It was just so much. It was so much pee, dude. I I'm proud of you, Mike. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Thank you. So we have, we we've got the boy. I we've stayed on the boy. Ashbell, thank you so much for the big boy, for the friend. With whom I will now have soft tacos. You're having soft tacos later. With with with, with him with the with the with the uh, there is an Asaurus. Hmm. Um, and then we have I, I don't know if you know about this, but starry feathers more often than not um, creates little sketch pages of everything that happened on the stream, and it's always so good. Oh, that's fucking like awesome! Always. That's oh, awesome. Era four hundred four has been, has just been flicking bits at me. Yeah, they're trying to they're, they're trying to get to, to the next uh, hype train. Yeah, the, the hype train. It's I at turned ninety nine percent. I turned that off on my channel, but I'm, sometimes I think about sometimes I entertain putting it back on, but then chat's like, "Don't you dare!" <laughs> really? 
Yeah, I don't know. I because because yeah. because it's it's it's. I guess I guess it's distracting. I guess. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, yeah. See, my stream is nothing but distractions, so right, right, right. I'm okay with it. I mean, like I, I actually I I debated adding uh sound alerts like no sound alerts you don't want people, that but it, it just didn't that. quite. I, I don't no. think it quite works on my stream. No, not for you. You know. No, I I, I chatted with Vex about it. I chatted with people. As, as much fun as it would be. Um, I think it just wouldn't suit the vibe of the stream. No, I don't think so. The, oh. Yeah, the interruptions. Um, but look, look, look at this. Starry Feathers comes back with a very active sketch page. Starry Feathers, this is this is so good. I'm I'm just perusing all of them, and it's it's all so good. So let's look at that. Uh, Starry Feathers always does closer up versions because looking at the whole thing, like, Twitter destroys the quality. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have uh, Thick Dumpy, good Bean Tardis, Infinite Beans, uh, Doctor. <laughs> so many moments. Yeah, like, you you forget you forget like you said these things, right? And yeah. Then you see some art like this, and it's like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, exactly. Oh well, here's here's why like people like. The content, right? Because like we, you know, like, like 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 here's why people will will watch because it's like because I, you know, when I when I end the stream, I'm I'm like I'm like why why did anybody watch that? You know, because yeah. I don't rem I don't remember any of this stuff. You know, yeah, <laughs> yeah. it all just kind of because you're so focused on just the stream itself, you're not yeah. like committing any of it to memory. Yeah, because... yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, come come, Mike in thirty years. <laughs> <laughs> I like Robo Milk, right? Because you're going onto the stream, yeah. Robo Milf is really, but it's good. it's Lauren with a mask with the the, the mic mask on. Is yes, what it looks like. Yes, yeah, yeah. It is. <laughs> we have Soda Mountain, <laughs> Mount Shasta, Sh Mount Shasta. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking awesome, dude. He's drinking the soda. And, and Mike, would you? He could take the whole hug. <laughs> and then just yeah. this face. This face is so. <gasps> Accurate. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So that's accurate. Exact, and, that's and I exactly love how yeah, it went, Mike went and I, It's Mike and I going out to get burgers before yes! stream. <laughs> oh, that was fucking great. Oh. Yeah, I, I sent that. To, so the, the initial iteration was <laughs> so like good. me saying like like <laughs> me writing Mike to go out and get, but that felt that felt a little bit too mean. So I deleted that and like did, did it and didn't specify and i really like this interpretation of like stolas lauren <laughs> and uh, jabroni chan writing stolas lauren out to get burgers you think it was too mean to write you think it was too mean to ride me i i i yeah i don't know it felt mean because you're because you're insinuating that i'm like a, a beast of burden right right it, who, who is like intellectually uh inferior yeah yeah, yeah it, it, it felt it, it felt a little mean I felt I felt oh. bad. I felt bad enough that I deleted it and then reposted it and changed it. Aw. Borger. Borger. Borg to Borger. <laughs> Away we go Mike. to Borg. Wallowing brainless wallowing herds. Yep. Mike is a disembodied voice. Come. Wait a minute. No, you guys. We have we have a video God? for this. God? We have, we, have, we have a video for this. Let me find it. Where is it? I remember I spent a minute. I know where I can find it. Give me a minute. Um, uh, Mew? Wait. Oh, Mew. mother fuck. Hold on. Oh, wait. that there it is. I'm like, Mewtwo? I can, fi I can find it. Get, just give me a second. Scroll, Hermie. scroll, 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 scroll. It's a uh, guy. It's Ve it's Vex's Tumblr. Oh, was that a piece? I, I I saw it on on Vex's Tumblr. I think you just scrolled past something that looked very, very, very penisy. Vex has so well. I, it's not on stream right now. Oh, no, um, nobody oh. can see. Oh, all right, okay. Yeah, Vex has so much like oh. cute stuff, furry stuff, and then cursed stuff, and it's incredible. You never really know what you're going to get. But it's always going to be good. There it is. Found it. Let's take a look. No, I I'm, I'm when the Okay, uh people people need to be able to see this. Because this this was you. This was you during the entire stream. 
Now I watched when the Lamb opened one of the seven seals, and I heard one of the four living creatures say with a voice like thunder, Come! <laughs> okay. It's you. <laughs> right, right. I get the right. But I mean, I, I look. I'm. I maintain that I kept the coming to a minimum here. Yeah. Okay. I, 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 as little as you could. It's just look. The cum just gets everywhere, and sometimes you can't help it. One more time. Now I watched when the lamb <laughs> opened one of the seven seals, and I heard. I know that this is a very minor thing, but like. It still annoys me that he's pressing onto the wax seal like it's a fucking button. Yeah, I dude, I when you first pulled it up, I thought that that was a, uh, a like a, like a controller. I thought he was holding a fucking like Xbox controller or something. I don't know well, what the fuck. I, it's a scroll. I understand now, right? Yeah. How how do we show that it's heaven? Let's put a million filters on it. That sounds good. <laughs> yeah. Heard one of the four living to the point where you can't tell what anything like even thunder. is. Come. Yeah, that's just a furry like screaming come, dude. It is. Yeah. It, it literally is. Um Better make sure there's no wolf cock. No, rut row. I am a you I can't believe you missed it. Okay, but whatever. I mean, it didn't whatever. <laughs> don't, don't, don't worry. We about need it. to break Mike. Earthbound uh. foreplay, huh? <laughs> Cheeseless we're, pizza. No, the, we're we're doing the Ludovico technique on you. Oh and yeah, showing yeah, you, yeah. And showing you pizza. <laughs> yeah, I see it. Yep. <laughs> we have edgy Mars, right? <laughs> uh, sensor F owl. Yeah, that <laughs> sensor foul. Ha 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 ha. No, I can't see the peepee. -pee. Owls are strigi formes. Uh, there's the 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 binary uh dialogue you know to avoid Stridgeful. to avoid to avoid saying uh slurs mm -hmm. yeah ha 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 earthbound foreplay ha. <laughs> slug yeah. that's what it is i think this is a live slug reaction mm -hmm. cheeseless pizza angry mic noises <laughs> and then you're not even good in. Oh no! It's <laughs> yeah! Lauren as a Sonic oh. OC. That's going in the. Oh in the, no! In the Lauren verse, it, it's the Lauren verse. See, I was afraid you were going to say it's going in your spank bank. No, I was not going to say that. I was like ready. I was braced for it. That's not no. But, but hey. Oh, um, I can. Why not? It won't listen. That it'll be it'll way. be a, a a challenging fap, but I think one that will be worth the effort. Right. <laughs> Much <laughs> this, like all this tomorrow's. is your Everest. Yeah, this is my Everest. Yeah, you're new for it. God damn it. Prep for Pender's stream. Yeah, because uh, Vex, you, Vex is doing research on Ken Pender's. And you're gonna going to do a whole pen, a whole Pender's thing, huh? Yeah, we're going to oh, do a Pender's stream with That's going to be so much fun. Vex, Vex has a VTubing rig now, too, and it's it, Kirpe also made it, and it's so cute. Oh, it's the best. Uh, so my brother... Mm -hmm. I can't wait to see it. Yeah, so my brother is just... Look... My brother is a protagonist. Like I have, I have since accepted the fact that, uh, like I am the supporting character and Corey is the protagonist. Not <laughs> only does he have a scar above his eye, but he also has a single lock of pure white hair in his like brown, like, like brown, very lightly red tinged hair. Strong like protagonist features, right? Yeah, very protagonist. protagonist. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, he's <laughs> Lauren's cooler, bro. And star person. Oh no, he's hot. Solid four out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> Crab and duck. Good. And immersion ruined. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, Starry Feathers, this is so good. Thank, thank you so much. Do we have? Okay, I'm gonna do one. Fred last OC check. was was a good attempt for your 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 first attempt at a Mobian. They said it was their first attempt at a at a Mobian, but I think it, I think it's solid. <laughs> nice cock, bro. Sensors bottom. Oh, 
I this this stream has gone on for an extra hour though. I mean, that's not that surprising with Mike on. Hey, I Mike. tend to distract. Yeah, yeah. Dead or Ungolas has been subbed for three months now. Yeah, those numbers are starting to in in crass. And they say, "Sorry, I missed the stream." Hello, Fred and Mike. I hope you're both well. I'm doing okay. I'm tired, uh, but I'm okay. And uh, and seriously, why are you apologizing for missing a stream? I make the stream for you guys. You know that, right? Like you don't owe me anything. <laughs> I like I want to make something that's fun and and enjoyable. So please <laughs> don't apologize. No, thank you all for coming. And and thank you for popping in at the end that are in Golas and Mike, of course. Thank you so much for getting up early, earlier than you otherwise would. And um, I know how it is to stream when you're just like super sleepy. So thank you for taking the effort to. Uh, I got it. No, and... I I did I did get I did get actually a, a decent night's sleep okay. last night. Okay, so good. it's not even good. like it was a big. Uh, it, it, it's it's just like I'm not. It's not even that I'm not necessarily awake around this time. Like it's it's that it's just that I'm not like ready to exist yet. Like that was the harder part. Like getting ready to exist. Mm -hmm. If that if that no, makes sense. And, and and like use my brain and mouth and throat and and, and all that. But um. No. Uh, I am very. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. we, we, we have are... one more piece of fan art, <laughs> and it is Ooh, who's uh, that? It it's the VRB screen, but with with, with a little friend on the side. <laughs> <clears throat> poke, poke, poke in it. And who's that? Who who could that? Who be? could it be? I, I wonder. Um, oh. No, but thank you. Yeah, thank you, Chad, for watching, and, and Fred, thank you for having me on. It was it was it was a uh, it was a pleasure, man. I'd I'd love to come back whenever you want to have me. Yeah, and, of course. Um, and yeah, um, if you want to, if you want, we we could we could continue this on my channel at some point, or we could yeah. just you know that way I can um I can sleep in a little bit, a little bit. Yeah, no, absolutely. We'll we'll um, do this on your stream next, and I'll I'll save it and. and uh, yeah. we'll, we'll bid uh, let, we'll bid you adieu, and I'll give uh, a final goodbye uh, to my stream after you go. Okay, adieu, do, do, chat. Uh, <laughs> bye, Mike. Bye, dude.